Beautiful people, I see that you're here already. I am also here. <laughs> if you came to watch Kasaya sew today, joke's on you, she's not here. <laughs> <laughs> I am Susan and I am her sister and this is a takeover video. I believe it's the third or fourth takeover video that we've done, which means I have access to all of her logins and passwords. <laughs> And I thought I was hilarious one time that I could just hop on and make a video. And it was fun and you guys were so awesome to help me. And so I've been learning and so it's going to be another takeover video today. So if you haven't already seen, we're making the Fundamental Tote by Jolie Lee Creations. And she made a coupon today, which we'll talk about in just a second. I'll let everyone kind of get on. Hi everyone. We Look, like, everyone's popping on. We like your takeovers. Lots of high Susans. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, the wording on mine's all jumbled. I can't even read it. So, My friend Shearston is here. Her, she has three little boys, and she lives in Vegas. And she was on her way home and said, can I come hang out? And I said, absolutely. So we were hanging out in the other room, and I said, well, if you're still here, you're going to come do a video with me. Come sit in this chair. <laughs> so can I, can I have you say hi to everyone? Okay. Everyone say hi to Shearston. Hello. She's going to read the comments for me until her boys get so crazy that she has to go home. But right now they're all happy. So we're just ignoring the kids and we're going to sew. <laughs> Gabriella's popping popcorn for her boys and Abigail's hiding away in her room as she should. So. Hey Sid, how's your thumb? Um, it's currently wrapped up. It is better-ish. I think it's probably infected. So I'll go get some antibiotics for it. Um, it's not as bad as it was the other day. It's just sore. The cut itself is like completely healed. It healed beautifully. But there's a big pocket of infection. And so it's just like tight and red. You know, the things they tell you. <laughs> Don't be concerned unless it gets tight and red. It's that. Um, so I just covered it so when I'm messing with the fabric that it won't hurt my thumb. So, okay. Hi, Gabriella. How are you? I like my tray of food. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. You want to say hi to the people? Hi. What up? What up? Okay, have fun. Okay. All right, I think we're ready to start. I don't know, have you seen Kasaya on here? When the um, Kasaya's I back? did, I think I did. Someone's asked how she was feeling. She what is um, feeling better from the initial um, symptoms and now she has an ear infection. So now she's heading in tomorrow to get stuff for her ear infection, but the the initial sickness is a lot better. She gets ear infections um, anytime she gets sick. That kind of, kind of tends to be her thing. So she just needs to get it cleared up before she flies to California on Wednesday. Because yeah. I just said I'm here. Oh, good. My um, Shearson's going to read for me, and the comments that pop on my phone, the words are all on top of each other. So... I don't know if I did something wrong with my settings, but there it is. Okay, let's get going. So there is a code for this, and I'm hoping those of you who are uh, moderating can kind of help me with this. Um, Leslie from Jolie Lee Creations made a $2 off coupon if you want to buy this pattern from now until a certain day that someone's going to put in the um, comments. And I think the code is Susan can <laughs> or something like that, since I can try to do this. This is a tote that she wrote with beginners in mind. And as you guys know, I'm a beginner. Um, it's super cute. It would be awesome if I told you that I practiced one first. I didn't. But I watched a video on how to do it from this one person named Kasaya something. And I watched a video. And so I pretty much am a professional now. So... How are you liking your Yuki, Juki? Is Juki, oh, this is my Juki. I am loving it. I love it. I actually, it, it causes me to think of it. I go to bed thinking, what should I do with it the next day? And I wake up wondering what I can do with it. Like, I love it. So before we get started, I'll kind of show you what we have and then ask you to help me solve a problem. Because um, I've heard a few people talk about how they want to make this, but they don't necessarily have the right hardware. So this one right here in the picture and the pattern itself calls for these, I actually don't know what they're called, prong connectors maybe. They look like this. You guys, you guys can chat to each other and say what it's called, but I think it's prong connectors. 
Um, and so some people have said they couldn't make it because they don't have prong connectors. But actually, you could just connect the strap any way you want on the outside. You could connect it in another way. You could do a hidden connector with like the, hopefully I'm saying this right, with the rectangle rings or maybe D rings, or you could just sew on the strap to the end. If I'm saying wrong things, just fix it for me, okay? Uh, Saya says she sells them on the website. Yeah, she has them. I only have one set of them, so I didn't make a practice because then I wouldn't have some for the next one. But. And Annette linked the Oh, good. Tote. Okay, thank you, Annette. So. so, the other thing that it calls for are some strap ends. Um, and I don't have strap ends. And so I'm wondering if you guys can help me. So after we make the straps, um, we're gonna fold and fold and stitch this baby. Fold and fold and stitch, okay, to make this strap. I don't have strap ends for these. And I'm wondering, what would you guys do? Would you just leave it raw? Or would you maybe cut off another piece of vinyl and just put it over the edge of it? Um, Anyway, so any thoughts on that, on how I can fix that problem would be great. You're saying nothing's, leave it raw. Leave it raw? That's what your sister said. Oh, okay. And then someone also asked if you named your Juki. I haven't named it yet. Someone gave me a really good idea. Um, I haven't named it yet. It just, it has to talk to me. It'll talk to me. One of these days it's going to tell me what its name is, and then I will announce it to the world. Denise says she made hers with D-rings and invisible connectors. And oh. She said wait to get the strap ends. Okay. That's what she said. Well, for today, I'm just going to do it the way it is Perfect. without the strap ends, and we're going to go for it. Okay. So the first thing we're going to actually do is move the camera. I've prepped a few things so that hopefully I can actually finish this bag, because as you all know, I think it took me two hours to make a 15-minute pencil pouch last time. I made a pencil pouch, and it said, this is an easy bag you can make in 15 minutes. <laughs> two hours later, our video is done. You guys remember that, don't you? <laughs> it's okay. I love it. It's fine. Oh, somebody said you should name your Juki Melody. Oh. That's a cute one. I really like style. that, actually. I really like that. Yeah. It should be a music name. It should be. <gasps> You're right. Yeah. Hmm. Now I'm going to have to think of all the music words. All names. the music words yeah. I could use, yeah. Um, Melody says, could you tell me which video it was where you and Saya used the brother scan to cut? To cut out wallet card inserts? Because Saya would probably have to tell you that one. Okay. Because, Kasaya. yeah. Kasai, that one's going to be all you. All right, we're going to go over the pieces we're going to use for this. Um, we have our two straps that we made for this. Um, and they're, they're three inches wide because you're going to use quarter inch prong connectors and you have to fold and fold. So um, we have the two exterior pieces. I've already attached some of the connectors. We're going to do one here, but I was trying to save time. So I have my exterior, which is made out of a vinyl that I got from Wizardry and Stitchery. I think I'm saying that right. I actually bought my own material for once with my own money, and I didn't steal it from Kasaya. <laughs> However, this is from Kasaya's closet. <laughs> <laughs> um, and she said she got it from Fabric Therapy, and this is canvas. And you're going to ask me, is it water-resistant canvas or waterproof canvas? I have no idea. But Kasai is on the chat. She can tell you. But it is from Fabric Therapy. This is the same kind of line that she gets her, her, her ones with the splatter on it. This one is just without the splatter. And then this is some cotton woven for the slip pocket and for the um, zipper pocket. And this stuff is interfaced with SF101. I think I even said it right. Got it from Walmart. Thank you very much. Um, and I got this material from my mom's closet last night. <laughs> Went to her house for dinner. I walked back into her fabric room and I said, can I have some of this? And I, so it was just from her quilting stash. The exterior pieces are interfaced with Decaville something. It's either light or heavy. It's whatever one side gave me. I think it's Decaville light. <laughs> and then I have this, which is an embellishment for the slip pocket. It's just a piece of vinyl. 
And I have a zipper with this cute little um, handmade, it says handmade on the zipper pull. I'm not sure where I got it, so good luck with that. And I got this incredible zipper overlay. Do you see this? Leslie made it from Jolie Lee Creations, and she put my logo on it. So I think since we're doing this one, I'm not going to do a tag on the outside. I'm gonna call this good. Any questions? It says here that since, just a suggestion for your machine, since they're trouble, you should call it treble. <gasps> oh my gosh. Well, that's pretty clever. That is super clever. Nice pun. I am going to be doing some kind of musical thing. Thank you very much. And someone else asked if you had a music channel. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I've had a lot of people requesting that. I'm not sure what I would do on that music channel. I, I want to know. Would you, you would you subscribe if I, I had a music channel? I would totally subscribe. Shearson's known me for many, many years. Yes, I have. Okay, bye, Teddy. Yes, I would definitely subscribe. For sure. Okay, okay. we're going to start with prepping the straps um, so that we can kind of have those done and out of the way. I've marked the center of my straps and I've put some double-sided tape on either side of the center line. And I'm just going to fold this. I have to like, see if I'm doing this right. If I'm doing something wrong, you guys have to chat and tell me to stop before I do anything permanent, okay? So I'm just gonna fold these to the middle. All beautiful like this. Hi. Look, she's, she's reading my comments for me. And my husband's here. Say hi to everyone, Brian. Hello, everybody. <laughs> We've taken over the room. Awesome. Yeah. I usually do this in the music room, which also doubles as our guest room, but Kasaya's older, one of her older sons is visiting from college with his girlfriend. And since Kasaya ended up not coming this weekend, the girlfriend got the nice room. So she's got the bed out in there and all her stuff, and I didn't want to displace her. So I just came into my bedroom, which works out great because then the kids can run wherever they want. That's right. So I'm just doing my best to fold it to the middle. It's not perfect, but I'm pretty sure none of you care. I care a little bit. <laughs> Susan is a pro now, this gypsy woman. <laughs> Such a pro. I watched one video on this. Wendy, so you know that I'm a pro. <laughs> and now I'm going to take that off. The code is Susan Can exclamation point. Susan Can exclamation point. And if you want to buy a, a pattern, then it's a little bit cheaper right now. $2 off, I think. Yes, that's what it is says. Is that what it says? $2 yeah. off? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. well, it looks like all the admins are adding the links and stuff. Yeah, they're so. amazing at that. Yeah. I can't be doing that. Mm -mm. You saw me just trying to set up the link. <laughs> she was in here laughing at me when I was trying to set it up. Of course not. If she were, you're giggling a lot. Because you're funny, not because you're <laughs> incapable. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ooh, I'm a little hot for a minute. See you. i got to go up for yeah, just a minute. Yeah, turn it on. Um, Gypsy Woman said she's made four of these. She really likes the pattern. Oh my gosh. I saw that you made so many. I was actually going to make sure that you were on here so you could help me. So, Wendy, it's your responsibility if I'm about to do something stupid. You have to say it in the chat before it's permanent, okay? All right. Oh, you do? Okay. Okay. High and bye. Now I'm going to put one more piece of double-sided tape, and I'm going to fold it all the way over and then stitch it closed. And if I should do that, you know what to do. Stop me now. More you put it him out. names, suggestions, okay. Rhapsody, <gasps> Lyric. There were some from earlier too. I think Cadence, someone said Cadence. Oh my gosh, those are all really good names. I know, creative people. I'm trying to find, oh, Synchro. Harmony. <laughs> What's a good music word that starts with a J? A J. That's hard. Jubilee. Ju oh, yeah, Jubilant. Jubilant. Jub Jubilant. Um, Jubilant. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I 
I'm gonna I'm gonna Google it. She's gonna Google some music words. Yes, I am. To see what we can get. Let's start. Oops. Oh, come on. And I'm gonna go ahead and clip this too because it's oh, just jazzy. Oh, jazzy. That's a good one. Aria. That's so pretty. <clears throat> okay. I'm looking here to see what else I So I'm just gonna clip my strap. I don't know if the, if the camera angle needs to change, let me know. <laughs> I'm just trying to show you this area here. Hopefully Wendy, is that Gypsy Woman? She yeah. says, you're doing it smarter than me. I clipped my straps, and I don't like stitching over the tape. Yeah, I tried, so. to, put the, I tried to put the tape out of where I'm going to be <gasps> stitching, but who knows? Joke's on me. I'll probably go right through it. <laughs> Jezebel. Jezebel. Ooh. There you go. Jezebel. She's, she's, she's Jezebel little, the Jukey. The Jukey, yes. Jazz. Jembe, but that Jembe had a D. It does. It starts it. with a D. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Someone whoever made this list. Jig. Jig. I could call it Jiggy. Mr. Jingles. Oh what? <laughs> my gosh, who said Mr. Jingles? That was um Emiliata. Um I think it might have to be Mr. Jingles. That's cute. That's it. It's I Mr. Jingles. It. We're done. I love it. I love it. You win. That's cute. Yeah, Jubilate. Yeah, there's not a lot of... No, it's Mr. Jingles. Yeah, Mr. Jingles is great. Um, I love it. Okay, <laughs> Mr. Jingles and I are going to attempt to make this tote right here. Come on, Mr. Jingles. <laughs> I love that. I love it. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and stitch up both sides of this. It's really thick. Frankly, I'm a little concerned. You can do it. Oh, I, I can, but I'm not sure if Mickle, Mr. Jingles is up to it. Mr. Jingles, just give him a little love. Mr. Jingles, I feel like you just need to try. Yeah. Okay, I don't want to hit the... Okay. If anyone wants me to stop, you know, you better tell me. Okay, I hope it works. Come on, Mr. Jingles. Let's go, Mr. Let's do Jingles. it. Let's do it, Mr. Jingles. <laughs> Cute name. I love very, that very name. good. Make your foot higher, Leslie says. Make it higher? Yeah. Oh, that's this thing, right? Your machine can do it, trust me. Remember to stitch down the same way along each side. Oh, so it doesn't Saya pull says. weird. I'm glad you yeah. said that, Saya, thank you. So the strap doesn't twist. Saya, you're so smart. Maybe use a top stitch needle for bulk. Someone said. Well, too late. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Jingles has already eaten it. He's already in there. It's already in his mouth. Yep. Her foot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. It's going through it just fine. Mr. Jingles. <laughs> He's going to be so joyously jubilant for the holiday season he is up. i'm gonna write him a song you should <laughs> i know a guy his name is mr jingles he's my friend sturdy and reliable <laughs> uh, lots of laughs and if I want to, for short, it's MJ, Mr. Ooh, Jingles. Yes, And MJ. I love Michael Jordan. There oh my go. gosh. It's, I'm so happy right now. It's meant to be. MJ, Mr. Jingles, MJ. MJ, I love you so much. Literally music made, Max says. Yep. I love it. Dun, dun, the Green dun. Mile, is that the movie? She said it's the mouse from the movie in The Green Mile. Oh, oh Beth is asking who's in the room. I'm oh, Sh I'm Sherston. It's my friend Sherston, and she was driving through on her way home back to Las Vegas and said, can I come visit? And I said, 
you sure can come sit in this chair and read comments for me because I'm doing a video. <laughs> she said, what the heck? And she's sitting here while her three boys are playing with my kids and That's right. running around and getting snacks. And That's we figured right. she can stay here with me until the natives get restless. That's right. Um, okay. Lots of suggested lyrics coming in for your songs. Oh, shoot. I don't know which way I started from. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Uh-oh. I don't either. I don't know which way I started from, you guys. Susan, you look so much more relaxed at your machine since the last live. You Thank got you. this, girl. Dang it, you guys. I don't know which way I started. Let's think about this. Well, I'm just doing it. <laughs> Here's a line. Mr. Jingle and I like to sew and mingle. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go mingle with Mr. Jingle. <laughs> I love it. There's one other one. But... Your right hand has the start, Adriel said. They said, just go for it, your sister said. All right, well, it's, it's, yep. it's happening. If I hate it, then I just won't use this one. <laughs> Mr. Jingle's got lots of energy today, so. Everyone's saying you're doing fantastic. Thank you, you're so beautiful, all of you. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm thinking I can't see very well. I forgot yeah, to put my glasses, glasses on. on. Yeah, yeah. got good mom. As we uh, get older here. Our old eyes need these reading glasses. Uh -huh. Hey, is it, uh... Hi. Is it a more oh, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. We have a strap. There is a strap. Oh no. Oh no. <coughs> oh no. <laughs> Well, you know what? We'll just, I'll do that later. Um, <sighs> Look what happened, you guys. Can you see it? The bobbin went all crazy. If the bobbin's loose, I need to tighten the top. Right? It's okay. We'll do straps later. Your sister says it's not bad. Saya, you would not carry this thing around, and you know it. Shoot. And Stitcher says, here's another line. When I sew on Mr. Jingle, he gets a little tingle. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Keep it PG, folks. Just kidding. Just kidding. That's funny. Okay. I love it. Well, anyways, that's how you make a strap. I'm going to go. <laughs> Move I'm on. I'm gonna rip that out Your and fix the tension. I'm not worried about it. Because I can I can put the straps on later. Okay. Next. We are going to attach the zipper overlay and make our zipper portion. And so what we're gonna do is we're going to take one of our lining pieces. Okay. And this is where I have to look for a second. <laughs> is your needle sticky, they're saying? Oh, I need to do a thing. Oh my gosh, it is. That's what it was. I sewed through the tape. See, they're that so was smart. That Cindy. Good job, Cindy, Cindy Benson. Cindy, you're genius. I wish I had stickers and prizes to give to everyone mm -hmm. who helps me. Right. And you get a sticker, and you get a sticker. Yeah, I'll go fix that strap later, but you get the idea. Yeah. Okay, before we do the zipper overlay, I'm going to show you how to attach the prong connector, which I'm sure you've all done, and I haven't, so it's hilarious that I'm teaching you. So, the pattern has you mark certain lines on it, which I've already done, which help you to place your, um, your connectors, but also later, because this is gonna be, this is gonna make it sound like I know what I'm doing, okay? Because it's a drop-in lining, we'll be folding a certain portion down on the top to that line. Did I sound smart just now? It's totally. So, what we're gonna do is we are going to have to mark where to put our slits. So these are the washers that you use for these connectors. And for this particular connector, 
you're gonna notice that when you push these prongs straight, that they fit through, Let's see if I can show you, they fit through the top one and the second to bottom one, if you could see that. And so when I mark it, that's where I'm gonna mark it on this washer. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my piece and I'm going to place the washer um, even with this line and centered. So I'm gonna be here. I'm going to mark the top hole and the second to bottom hole. And then I'm gonna take a blade and I'm gonna cut a slit in it. So let me do that really quick. They said, you sound so official, your sister says. Oh my gosh, so yes. official. You can't even stand it, right, Saya? And Gypsy Woman says, you sound like the pro. Mm -hmm. That is the teacher in you. You are learning so much. Your sister says you're a natural. Runs in the family. Not this part. <laughs> I already messed up the first thing I sewed today, but thank you so much, everyone. You're so beautiful. So I'm going to take this right here, and I'm going to mark this baby. And it is a baby because it's little. Come here, baby. Marky. Mark. Okay, and then the funky I have a little, exactly. I have a bowl because I lose everything. And so now I'm putting things in the bowl in case you wanted to know. Now, you guys know that I like to slice parts of my body on accident. And um, I am now using the blade, so be very afraid. You got this. Okay, I have a piece of this Decaville light slash heavy. I have no idea. It's whatever I used. Kasaya, maybe you can say what it is. And I've I've done the same thing on this. I've marked the same distance, okay? And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this prong strap in from the very front where I just put those slits. Heavy, your sister said. Oh, it's heavy? Yeah. That's what I was gonna say, but I just wanted, I wanted her to feel like she was adding value to my show yeah. today. Yeah. If anyone came Recently, and you're wondering where Kasaya is, I've taken over her channel. I am Susan, I'm her sister. And she is not here except for on chat, so there's nothing she can do except try to help. <laughs> so if you're disappointed and you're thinking this is not what I signed up for, don't unsubscribe from her channel. This is a disclaimer I always put. I promise I won't do this very much. But now I've put the Decaville Heavy on, I or light, what would she say it was? Heavy. Um, heavy. And then I have put the washer on top of it. And now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to fold the prongs to the middle like this. Boom. And if you say boom, it goes flatter. Mm, boom. Boom. And if you say chicka with the boom, it boom, goes boom, 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 chicka, boom. Mm. Okay. <laughs> and then what we're going to do is we're going to cover it with duct tape. And now I've seen Kasaya and other people use white tape and blue tape and beautiful tape. I only have silver duct tape, so if I'm not supposed to use this, it's too bad, because I already am. Hello. Hi. Duct tape. How's it going? Good. Abigail said that she found your other ghost earring at the Warner's. Oh, that's awesome. By the way, I'm wearing a ghost and a pumpkin. I like it. <laughs> Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> okay, so there we go. I've got the backs of that, and the front looks just like this. Um, and then later, I'll come, and we will connect the strap to it. It may or may not happen during this video. But those are both done like this. Now I'm choosing not to put a tag. At this point you would put a tag. If you wanna put a tag, um, you would put a tag here. I'm choosing not to because my zipper overlay already has my logo on it. And if someone else ends up having this bag, I feel like that's a little pretentious to put my name on it twice. <laughs> it's like, okay, we know. <laughs> Brittany says, we love a Susan takeover. Yay, Brittany. And it's fun when you're in school and get a really cool substitute teacher. Oh yeah, that's oh, right, yeah. I'm the substitute yeah. teacher. Yeah. yeah, Okay. The cool sub. I like that. Okay, next we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna make our zipper pocket. So we're gonna start by um, getting the zipper portion of it ready. So I need to figure out actually how to measure this and we're gonna attach the zipper overlay first and then cut it out. This is how you, this is how I read so no one can see what it is. But where do I put it? I don't get it. 
Oh, I get it. Okay. So I need to mark the lining. Good job for having alcohol slob, slobs, swabs by your machine to clean your needle. Oh, thank you. Yes. Okay, I don't know if I'm doing this part right, so you guys might have to, if Leslie or Kasaya is on here. Oh, that's in the camera, isn't it? Sorry. It's hard not to have it on the camera. You sound like the Charlie Brown teacher. I thought the same thing. Wah, 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 wah. Mm -hmm. It says to make some markings. Tied up. I'm gonna make some markings on my lining now which maybe I should have done before we started. Sorry. Your sister wants to know where her son is. Your son is at his friend's house, Russ or something like that. He's in town. I guess he got married and he lives here and they are hanging out and having dinner. Nice. And he will be here later. Maybe he'll be here before the video is over and he can say hi to his mommy. Yeah. Okay, and then I'm going to turn it this way and make another marking. And this is for later, for when we have to fold it down for the drop-in lining. She wants to see his face. He is, he does have a cute face. Aww. I mean, you know, you made that face. Yeah. And Robin says you're a very good explainer. Oh, thank you. That's great, because I don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> Page seven is the overlay placement, Gypsy Woman says. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Okay. And it's the Susan Swag Show. Yes. <laughs> I love the alliteration. It's nice, right? Good night, Bye. Lisa. Have a good sleep. She's got to go to bed. Oh, good night, Lisa. Susan needs a sewing design ruler. Oh, desk ruler. Sewing desk ruler. There was a heart over that. I know. I'm still using this massive quilt one. I bet Kasaya is cringing right now. I thought I bought the right ruler for um, bag making, but I bought the wrong one. It's fine. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Okay, now I got these marks. Sorry, I thought I had that before. So I need to make some markings. And now the light's going to be super funky, so hopefully it's okay. The sun's going to shine through that bathroom. Um, okay, page seven. If you're following along and you have your, um, your pattern with you. Oh, jury duty sharing. That doesn't sound fun. Okay. There's two different markings. So what I'm, what I'm looking at is when you mark the lining, you actually mark two different um, distances. And one of them is for the slip pocket and one of them is for the zipper pocket. So I'm just trying to make sure that I am doing the correct one for the zipper. That is the hesitation and I think I've got it figured out. Okay, so this is gonna be my um, zipper pocket lining. So what I'm going to do is this mark that I've made at the top of this lining, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put tape on the back of my um, zipper panel. Oh look, it's already on there. <laughs> and then I'm going to find the center and I'm just going to do that by fully increasing. It makes it sound like I know what I'm doing, but that's what Kasaya did on her video. Mm -hmm. And she sounded really smart when she did it. If you crease the material, then you don't have to mark it. That's what she said. <laughs> But I actually don't know where the middle of this thing is. Hmm. I don't really want to crease that, do I? Oh, well, I'm creasing it. Okay, and I'm going to go... Maybe I should measure it. That would be fun. I do have this little ruler. You guys like that one? <laughs> okay. So 
What I'm going to do is I'm going to stick this, oh, I have to take this tape off. I'm going to stick this down onto the lining, and then I'm going to cut out the middle, being super careful not to cut my super fancy, schmancy zipper overlay. Leslie, I love these things, and this is the first one that I'm using. I thought I better use my first one on your pattern. It's only fitting. Yes. Don't you think? Like, she's the one who made these for me. Yeah. That's, and this is her first pattern. It's darling. Isn't that so cool? It's so cute. Okay. So now I'm going to do my best to center this baby. Come here, baby. <laughs> okay, so now that's stuck on there. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to, with my very sharp scissors that I cut myself with the other day, <laughs> separate from the bagel incident <laughs> and separate from the razor blade incident um, I'm going to go ahead and cut all the way across this opening here and I'm just gonna go in the center like this and if you want to sing while you do it like this off and helps that's cute Okay, and then I'm going to turn it around so as I cut, I can kind of. Dragon? Sure. She okay. wants to show you her dragon real fast. And then it says sew the outer border of the zipper overlay first. Oh my gosh, Annette, I love you. Thank you. Yep, that. Here, she's going to show her dragon real quick, and then. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's cute. Okay, thank you. I forgot about that. So we're going to sew the outer border and I'm going to go ahead and leave the tails long so I can pull it through so it doesn't show the double stitch. And I'm just using black thread, which I know is lame because you can't see it, but I couldn't think of anything else that would look good with this. So, perfect. I'm going to go right there. They like the dragon. They want one now. It's cute, right? It is cute. Oh, you know what? A little bit longer. That was an avatar, didn't she? It was, yes. Okay. We call it a dragon for her because she likes okay. dragons. But we actually <laughs> got it from Disney World, and it's a, oh. it is from Avatar. Okay. Yeah. But don't tell her that. She thinks it's a dragon and that we got her a dragon, so shh. Shh. Mom's the word. I've never seen any of the avatars. They're really good. Yeah. The music's incredible. I bet it is. Okay, and I did learn a new trick because I kept getting rounded corners right here. And I know you guys all know this trick, but I'll say it. So I'm going to go one more stitch over. And then I'm going to pull my wheel towards me and make sure the needle finishes its rotation and starts coming up. Then I'm going to lift and move. Otherwise, it skips around the corner and doesn't do a straight corner. like the second Avatar movie? Is it called The Way of the Water? Is that you know what? what? I guess I didn't see the second one. I only saw the first. The first one. Who did the music? Was it John Williams? No. Oh. Um, I'll look it up. It might have been Hansi Baby, but I don't remember. Oh, really? I don't remember who did it. But no, it wasn't John Williams. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pull through this thread right now so I don't lose track. Natalie's thread. late to the party, but she's glad she's here. <gasps> go, Susan, go. Natalie, you're not late. I'm like on step two. <laughs> and step one, I messed up. <laughs> James Horner. <gasps> James Horner. <clears throat> he looks young. He's not, James Horner. But he's gotta be 60 at least. Okay. I'm not sure how to go around this corner, I'll be honest. Maybe I should just do it straight. Oh, wait. Zoop. You didn't mess up, Susan. It was the tape. Slowly, your sister says. Am I going too fast, sister? And make noises. 
doopy 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 doopy. That kind of sounded like the Oompa Loompas. <laughs> Oompa Loompa Loompa Dee Doo. Oops. If you're not getting a 90 corner, it's your tension. Check your threading, your lombuses. Uh, my quarters are looking good. Alrighty. They're looking good, babies. Yeah. Sorry, I'm slow. You guys have somewhere you need to be? Because this might not be the party for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. What other sounds can Mr. Oh. Jingles make? Oh, Mr. Jingles, he actually knows a lot of good songs. Yes. This is the all-nighter, and that's in for the night. <laughs> Annette knows me. <laughs> And that's seen me so before, she knows. In fact, anyone who's seen me so before is not expecting Speedy at all. And I appreciate that. I love it. But this is one of those things. If I can make this tote, anyone can make this tote. That's right. Okay, so I'm there. I'm gonna pull it long. Sure I'm gonna go. Yeah, it feels good. I'm gonna go choppy chop. And then, oh shoot, I don't know which one it was. I hate it when I do that. Found it. Yes. It's like a treasure hunt. Yes. Um, someone suggested the one eighth inch tape and um, your sister says she has some for you <gasps> to give you and a stapler, I... she said. Oh yeah, I don't have a stapler. I do have one inch. One eighth inch one eighth. tape. I used the big one for this, but maybe I shouldn't have. Okay, now I usually only did my knots twice, but I noticed Kasaya, you were doing your knots like three times. So I'm gonna copy her. Yes. Is that okay? Sister? Sisters are great. Sisters have to copy, right? Yeah. And this is where I have to turn the fan off, otherwise the lighter won't work. Danielle says you're doing great. <gasps> Thank you, Danielle. Is that the Danielle who I know? She says she's from Colorado, Brighton. Oh my gosh. Colorado. Yeah. I went to I went to I did my undergrad in Greeley at UNC, Ooh. right in that neck of woods. Back in the day. That was like over 20 years ago, but still. Of course, said with a Greek accent, says your sister. Of course. Did, it's, did you? It's for my big fat Greek pudding. I want to see the, um, the third Oh, movie. we saw it in the theater. I wanted, We're obsessed I wanted with, to see it. Of course. What is her name? Andrea something. I don't know. She's Aunt Vula. so funny. Aunt, Aunt Vula. Okay, yeah. so yeah. now we're going to cut this away, unless you tell me not to. But I'm just doing it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in and kind of pull it up so I can see it. These scissors are so sharp that I do worry sometimes about catching the overlay and accidentally cutting it and not even know I cut it. That would be so sad. Yeah. I think I would cry a little bit. So sad. Andrea Martin. Is that the actress? Is her name, yeah, Aunt Vula. Oh my gosh, those movies are so <laughs> funny. So, Terry says, if I have trouble tying the knot, I use a small piece Hello. of double-sided tape to hold them and just leave the paper on. Oh, that's so smart. And someone said you need duck bill scissors, whatever those are, Gypsy Woman says. Is that the kind where they're like, like, like this and then they go like that? I'm wondering if that's what that is. The double-sided tape from Weft and Warp doesn't bother... Sarah's needle, she says. And it makes sense that the duckbill scissors would look like a duckbill. Right? Yeah. And then someone said 26, is that? Oh yeah, Danielle. Uh -huh. She says her daughter is going to UNC for nursing. Oh, oh that's awesome. Be. That's awesome. Yeah. Go Bears. <laughs> I can still sing my fight song. That's a horn part. Go bears! 
That's the horn part. <laughs> UNC Barracks. Okay, so when you're done, you have this right here. Can you see? Somebody says I'm watching. <laughs> watching you, watching you. Okay, next we are going to assemble the pocket portion to the zipper and then we're gonna put that pocket onto the back of this. So I had to watch this part a couple times because I'll be honest, it hurt my brain just a little bit to understand it. So first I'm going to take the zipper face up and I'm gonna put it on this pocket piece face up. And I'm gonna line up the top edge like this and I'm gonna say voila. And I'm gonna clip a little bit. And I have to say this pattern, there's something that's so cool about this pattern. At the very end of the pattern, she has, it says all the things. And it says the seam allowance for each thing that you're doing. So I can just look on here really quick. And my seam allowance is going to be quarter inch. That's kind of cool. Natalie loves your stitching. You're so profesh. Oh, thanks. And Kasaya says you're amazing. I'm paying Kasaya, actually. <laughs> your money will be in the mail. <laughs> Sometime. Sometime. <laughs> Sometime. Okay. Wait, make sure I did that right. Just a second. I'm going to do my Charlie Brown read. <laughs> Oh no, it's an eighth. It's an eighth. Okay. Yep, I'm glad I did that because that was the wrong one. Your sister's waiting for the cash monies. I bet you are. <laughs> the cash monies, honey. <laughs> okay. We're just going to go ahead and base this on or sew it on. I don't know, we're gonna do stitches on it. Is it considered basting or sewing, this part? Anyone? Uh, Anyone, Bueller? I don't we're, know. We're waiting for a comment. But is your Juki an industrial machine? It, she said it's basting, your sister said. Oh, it's basting. No, this is, it's a heavier duty, it's a domestic. So, I guess, according to Kasaya, there's a big debate in the sewing world, big debate on whether or not there's such thing as a semi-industrial. So some people call this machine a semi-industrial, um, but really, yeah, it is a domestic machine, but it's heavier duty than my Bernina, which is what I was on before. And I am in love with it. Mr. Jingles. Mr. Jingles. <laughs> I love you so much. Snip. Is light totally crazy right now? Can you guys see okay? I don't know what to do about it. The sun's about to, sh it's shining through my bathroom window and I could move my desk. Can you guys still see okay? All right, my next step, and this is the part that blows my mind a little bit. I'm gonna take my other pocket and I'm gonna put it face up and then I'm going to, give me just a second, okay? Your sister says it's okay. I'm gonna put, Oh, I'm gonna put this pocket face down that has a zipper on it. I'm gonna flip the zipper face up and I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing on that upper edge. Unless you tell me not to. There you go. Your sister says yes. Okay. Repeat correct. Yeah, when people say repeat the step, it never makes sense to me because everything's flipped and different. Yeah. Like, just do the same thing. I'm, not, I'm like, that doesn't make any sense to me. Mm -hmm. But, but I, I get this now. <laughs> go, Susan, go. Mm -hmm. You need to have shirts made. What shirt? Susan can. Susan can. I think they meant. No. I do have a question for the hive mind later. I need to figure out what bag I can make that would fit my big conductor scores. 
I I enlarge my music to 11 by 14. And they, they make conducting bags, but it's a man's world, and so they're all man bags. You know what I mean? They're like yeah. boring. They're boring. So I need some kind of bag that can fit it. So think about that while I sew this next step on. Get on it, ladies. Get on it. Write her a pattern. Well, I'm sure I can just enlarge like a laptop bag or oh, something. You like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Or some kind of messenger bag. Oh, that would be cute. Yeah, that'd be really cute, actually. Yeah. yeah. Maybe I should do that. I like it. Kasaya shirt too. Oh, Sherry says we love Sherry. Oh, good job, Sherry. You're amazing. Sherry showed up to the North Carolina retreat wearing a shirt that said, "I'm gonna go make a bag with Susan and Saya," and it was the <gasps> cutest. Serious? Yes. Aww. That's darling. It's because we have a little jingle at the beginning of her videos that we made. I did a little song. We did a video, <laughs> and and. It's about going and making a bag. It's like, it goes, Shearston doesn't know this song, yeah, so totally pardon it. me while I sing it. So it starts off. Size wag, size wag. Dun, 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 dun. Let's go and make a bag. Dun, 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 dun. dun. She's not your bag. Dun, dun, dun. Let's go and make a bag with Sia Swag. Anyways, so it's let's go and make a bag. So that's why she did that. Okay, next I'm going to, now that I've got that done, I'm going to put some double-sided, and I do have the eighth inch size for this, and I'm going to put some double-sided tape on the edge of the zipper on both sides of it so we can attach it to our zipper overlay next. And I'm just going to go... Rosalind says you're doing so great. Oh, thanks, Rose. And then I'm catching up to Gypsy Woman. What's what's her name? Uh, Wendy. Wendy, that's right. Messenger bag. Susan, speaking of, did you finish the one from Sewing in the States? No, in fact, I just got the bag out the other day because I feel like I can do it now. I was really kind of scared to before. Mm. But now that I made those bags, we went to a Texas retreat and oh. I made a few bags. Oh. And now I'm like, okay, maybe mm. I can do it. Mm. Um, Stitcher says, uh, your sister could embroider these notes on your messenger oh, bag. Oh, Saya. Yes. Oh my gosh. Um, That's a great idea, Yolanda actually. Yolanda said she sings along to the song. That was lovely to hear <laughs> for the first time. Oh, thank you. <laughs> And then Sarah suggested um, a pattern. Oh, which pattern? Pattern it? suggestion, making backpack by Noodlehead. Okay. Okay. Maybe I'll screenshot that for you. So, or Thank you. Yeah, that's amazing. Um, okay. Next. Oh. Now, this is the part that I have I had a really hard time understanding, and it's the which way the zipper faces. So I'm gonna get this now, and what we're gonna do is, someone told me that the pointy end facing that way is where I want it to the left. The light's terrible, what can I do? Should I move do the you, desk? Do you have a, um, a towel? Is it so high that I can't? It's probably too high. Okay, because we could move this chair. No, what if I just move this desk back? Okay. I'm gonna try something really, although, Nope, it's more in the light over here. Um, just kidding, sorry. <laughs> you don't need to say anything anyways, do you? Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the sticky off of the bottom one with this facing to the left. So I'm gonna take this off. And... Everyone's telling you you're doing it right. <gasps> Thank and you. And Wendy says the light is fine. Okay. Sorry, there's not a door between my bedroom and the bathroom, and there's these big, big windows in the bathroom, which is interesting, right? <laughs> but, you know. Um, and we have curtains on the bottom half of the windows, but the top half of the windows, you know, I didn't want to cover up. Yeah. But I forgot at this time of day, it's really sunny. 
Okay, so I'm going to, with my pockets facing up like this, because I don't want to accidentally sew them, which would be so embarrassing, I am going to try to center this little guy inside this zipper overlay. So I'm gonna kind of look at it, look at it, gauge it, center it, and try to get it about where it needs to go. Oh, I love rice. That's so nice. It's yeah. terrible. Yeah, it's terrible. I'm not sure to do about it. We've decided there's nothing to be done. There's nothing to be done. <laughs> well, at least I have something. We'll just let the sun shine. Let the sun shine in. Okay. Is that right? It's hard to tell. The zipper. Yeah, that looks good. So I'm going to go do, 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 do. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to stitch along the bottom of the inside edge of the zipper lay. And I'm just gonna go slightly past each edge and I'm gonna leave the tails long so I can pull them through just the bottom. And I'm gonna make sure that my pockets are facing up so that I don't accidentally sew through them because then it would no longer be a pocket. It would be a disappointment. <laughs> what it would be. <laughs> Never. That's so cute. Cute, right? That's tarly. Do you want a tote? Sure. Do you want this to be yours? Sure. Okay, this is going to be Shirsten's. I'm so excited. Annette says perfect in capital letters. <gasps> Susan. Annette's my biggest fan. Yeah. Hard not to be a Susan fan. Just saying. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm sure. Okay. This is me concentrating, trying to get in the right place. This is very serious. In case you don't know, <laughs> this is serious. This is serious, guys. Cynthia says you're doing great. Thank you, Cynthia. No worries. Okay. You got this. Mr. Jingle, stitching it up. <laughs> Mr. Jingle, you're a, not in a rut. <laughs> so when my zipper for me, that's what you do, Mr. Jingles. <laughs> sewing it up, sewing it up. Sometimes Mr. Jingles likes to use his falsetto voice. <laughs> Mr. Jingles, sewing it up, sewing it up. <laughs> exactly. Thank you. See, he's talking to you too. One more. One more. Ooh, that was maybe too far. That's okay. Walk away. Walk away. Okay. Let it go. Let it go. I'm going to pull that out. I can't. I, I can't block the light with my body, Suzanne. I wish that I could, but it's really high up. Um, there might be something I can do. Oh, Bryce is gonna try. Oh, Bryce. Um, actually, that does help. Can you cut? Can you undo that and cover the whole thing? Let's see. I'll work on it. He's gonna work on it. No, just could just cover. Yeah, cover that part right there. Oh, <gasps> do the whole. Cover the whole over the whole shower, not just part of it. Yeah, that did it right. No, you're still on the wall, or... It's a lot better, though. That's a lot better. Now you need to add a wrap first. Okay, you got it. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> Just the other day, I was sewing the zipper. I didn't know what to do, but I'm a skipper, so I figured it out. I figured it out. I said, huh, 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 figured it out. What did you figure out? <laughs> How to sew the zipper. How in the world do I, everything's fine. I'm gonna figure, oh. Everything is awesome. I couldn't figure out where to find the thread, but I just found it. Yeah, that's better. Is the light better on the screen? Um, it's oh. getting, it's behind, but I can, we're almost. He's like, he's standing there just, holding something. Just stand there, Bryce, Bryce, is, for the next. I wish I could actually, I might actually turn the no, camera. No, 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 no. Clip. <laughs> <laughs> if I were to turn the camera around and you could see what my husband was doing so we could have good light right now, you guys would love him. No. And that asks, are you tying your knots? Yes, ma'am. Should I not be tying my knots? Uh-oh. Annette, should I wait? She says, then she said, you got it. And Natalie made a suggestion about a messenger bag. I screenshotted it for you. Oh, thank so. you. Should I, should I wait to tie my knots? Okay, that's not going to work, but I will get something real quick. So. Okay. I mean, it's still better down at the table, though. This part's still better, yeah. right? Yeah. I used to have something up. <laughs> I just recently took it down. That's why he's saying that. I just recently took it down. Yeah, I did. I can't believe you. I've just been so 
It's what hilarious. What were you thinking? I was thinking that it looked tacky. That's what I was thinking. You know, it's hard with those higher windows up top. Nothing looks good. Yeah. My name is Mr. Jingles, but some call me MJ. Hey, hey, MJ this way. Love it. Don loves watching you, Susan. Thanks, Don. If you were here, I would love watching you too. We would just watch each other. Mr. Jingles and Susan, so the zipper. Better get it right or it's the seam ripper. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Who was that? That was Amelia. Oh my gosh. That, that was, was so awesome. good. She even put little musical notes. Oh my gosh. In little comment. You guys are awesome. And I'm actually proud of myself for getting the phrasing right without I know, you totally reading got it. it ahead of time. So. Okay. Now, if memory serves me right, now we're going to flip the the pockets were up here, and now what you do is you flip it the other direction, and when you lift the zipper overlay up, we have tape along this top part of the zipper, and we're going to um, take this tape off now. Oh, gosh. When I pull the paper off, the tape comes off, too. How embarrassing. Let me try that again. This is gonna be a cute bag. So cute. The cutest. Cause it was musically made. It was musically made. You have to sing when you make it, right? Yeah. Sorry, Mesh. hold please. We're having technical difficulties. And, okay, there I got it. Lisa says, hi, I'm late. Hi, Lisa. You're never late with me, cause I take my time. <laughs> Susan takeover days where you're always on time because I'm always slow. Oh, <gasps> Bryce. That might be something. That's perfect. He is now taping a pillowcase to the top of the doorway. <laughs> He's on a ladder. He has the shower covered. Why are you letting people know how ghetto I am? <laughs> it's perfect. You're, you're getting things done. Getting uh, things done. Uh, that's perfect. Good. One more. Okay. He's going to tape one more pillowcase. Maybe I'll turn the camera around. Maybe I won't. <laughs> okay. See. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start. So Gabrielle I, says you're a genius. Bryce is a genius. is a genius. He, he is. Says, she says. He's doing a great job, that husband of mine. Okay, so this is stitched here. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start it from where I left off here. And I'm going to leave the tails long again so I can pull it through and not have to back stitch. And I'm going to come all the way around like this, and I'm gonna finish the box and leave those tails long too. But I'm gonna make sure that my pockets are flipped down so that when I sew up here, the pockets aren't caught in it. So, let's rock and roll. Rosalind says you're amazing, not ghetto. You're, you're <laughs> MacGyver-ish. Yep, MacGyver-ish. <laughs> oh my gosh, it totally worked. Yes. That's so much better. Beautiful. Thank you. Beautiful. Yeah, that's great, because it's not in my eyes. Uh, well, okay. No, it's fine. That part's fine. That's not, that's not running anything. Yeah, it's good. Mr. Jingles, Mr. Jingles. Oh, pull the zipper out of your way as you come around this side. Yes, I have learned the hard way. We won't talk about that. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. And then you can just lift your foot, move the zipper back behind out of the way for the rest of the stitching. Mr. Jingles, you're doing a great job, dude. Suzanne says you're on your way to having your own bag making a channel. Never. <laughs> I'll just show up and terrorize her channel. It's way more fun. <laughs> Dawn says she loves seeing you so. So, well, thanks. It's nice and slow for sure. <laughs> okay, I'm there. I'm, oh, almost there. There's a little gap. Are you okay with a little gap on your zipper overlay? Because this is yours. She likes it. I like it. It's a design choice. I love it. It's beautiful. Perfect. 
perfect. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and pull these threads through so that we don't have any ugly, I keep losing my, oh, there it is, my stiletto. And I can't see, I must have taken my glasses Sophie's off again. Sophie's asking how Kasaya is feeling, she's on. Kasaya, how are you feeling today? Yeah. I think she's got an ear infection. On a scale of one to 10, how would you rate Let's hear it, Saya. Your pain. Tell today. the people. The people want to know. Yes. They love Kasaya and they want you to feel good. Yes, we do. I'm not sure if watching me sew on your channel makes you feel good or bad, but it's done with love. I think everything done by Susan makes you feel better. <laughs> everything. I'll send a Care Bear stare. <laughs> Care Bear one. stare. Remember that yes. One? They, like, stood and they... Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Yes. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Jen says, we love you too, Susan. Oh, thanks, Jen. Yes. I'm just the comic relief. We all know it. <laughs> okay. Everyone loves watching you sew. I'm going to go ahead and trim these guys down. And I'm just going to take a lighter to them just so they, they kind of seal up and don't come undone. And we'll see if the lighter will work with my fan on. I was getting hot. The sun was like beating down on me. That's creepy. I look back and Bryce is still just standing there behind Hello. the pillowcases. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> it's falling. Oh, it's falling. Jen says you keep us in stitches. Uh -huh. Yay. Yay. <laughs> okay, so now we have, ladies and gentlemen, the zipper placed. And now what we have to do is we are going to sew down the side, the bottom, and the side. And I have no idea what seam allowance. So give me a minute, you know what I'm gonna do now. Okay, got it. Um, they need an update again on your finger, Susan. Oh, wants to know. Um, I have it wrapped right now, the, the, Cut itself is healed beautifully, but I'm pretty sure it's infected. So skin keeps peeling off and there's a pocket of red that's um, tight and tender to the touch. So that's not a problem, right? That's um, totally I'm normal. probably in a bit, <laughs> I'll go get antibiotics tomorrow. It is better than it was, so there's that. It's just not all the way healed. And it's not as tender as it, as it was before. But I knew if I was going to be tugging all this fabric, I just wanted to wrap it up. Okay. You've already got future subscribers to your bag making channel. Oh my gosh, I am so sure. Mm -hmm. And Leslie from Jolie Lee, she's, you're on the big screen, lady. Oh, shoot. Yeah. Unless you take me off that thing right now. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You take me off. <laughs> and Kimberly says you're a riot. She's cracking up. Susan is very funny. Well, my last name is Theriot, and the last four letters of my word are riot. Riot, that's right. The riot. That's right. With if my if it had an E instead of an I, my name would literally be the riot. The riot. <laughs> and Natalie says she that you're real, and that's why she what she loves about you. And it's true. Well, you got to keep it real, people. Keeping it real. Since 1970, whatever year we were born. <laughs> She's a 1970 something. 1970 something. Love it. Oh, Mr. Jingles. Don't we got a little excited. Yourself. Don't hurt yourself. Gee whiz. Oh, no, that's. Oh, no. Come on back. The measurements are wah, wah, wah. And it says. <laughs> Or wah, 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 wah. See, I'm not giving anything away. Nothing. We love a good Charlie Brown flick at our house. Yep. All right. I was going to try to get this tape off, but I'm just going to sew through it and I'll wipe it down. Get in there. <gasps> Don't you do that. Mr. Jingles. Mr. Jingles. Come on now. Silly. It's the pocket. It doesn't have to be perfect. Annette says. Annette? Yes, it does. 
Okay, she just told you you were wrong. <laughs> okay, now we're going to do these ones. We don't have to pull through because we don't care if the back is ugly. And we're just going to trim off. There's some excess um, zipper tape. And we're just going to trim a little bit of, ooh, not with those scissors. Ooh, that would have been bad. I'm going to do it with these guys. Trim. Trim. What kind of things are you going to keep in this pocket? Have you thought about that I yet? I don't know. I'm going to have to keep it away from my boys. Because they'll just destroy it. They would have to destroy it, wouldn't they? Yes, they would. My husband always says, the kids ruin everything. And I said, and that is why we don't have nice things. That's it's right. Okay. Yep, because they're know? kids. They're kids right now. They're little. <laughs> yep. Okay, that's good enough. Hi, Barbara from Toronto. Hi, Barbara. Okay, we have, let's see if it works. And... Okay, great. Next, we're going to make our slip pocket. And the slip pocket's going to go on the other piece of lining. Did you trim and burn? Someone said trim and burn. Who did it, right? I trimmed and I didn't burn. Thank you, whoever said that. That was Vicky. Good job, Vicky. See, they watch and, and they, they help said, me. don't forget to seal the lipper, lipper, zipper with a lighter. I was reading lighter. You said lipper. And saw the word zipper. Thank you, everyone. I almost forgot. That would have been disastrous just disastrous. disastrous okay next i'm going to let's think about this for a minute <laughs> okay i'm going to take my slip pocket which is lined and i'm going to go right sides together and what i'm going to do is i'm just going to sew down the sides and now i will make sure that i have it right <laughs> yep that's correct I don't know what I just dropped. Uh, Gala says you can train the pocket model. I don't know. Yeah, actually, that's a great idea. Okay. Who was that, Donna? Uh, Dalva. Oh, Dalva. Yeah. Yes, I see Dalva all the time. Yeah. Dalva, thank you. I shall take your advice because there's a lot of extra. And Jolene is logging in from Pocatello. And she's never been on live. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Please come back another time when Kasai is here because this is not normal. If this is your first live, I am her sister. I am not her. So don't be like, oh my gosh, I saw her so and she made so many mistakes. <laughs> it's me. It's me. It's not her. See? Okay. Leslie says she's so proud of you. Overlays can be so intimidating. Thank you. Well, your overlay you made is beautiful, so it did not intimidate me. <laughs> it was welcoming. Okay, now I'm going to come down and I'm going to go down the short sides of this um, soon-to-be slip pocket. I need to change my stitch length. So I'm just going to make my stitch length a little shorter than it was. I should have done that earlier, but I didn't. So, well. <laughs> Too late now. Doesn't matter, because the damage is done. Your sister has to go. Bye, Saya. <gasps> Saya, why do you want to leave me? Oh, wait, I think your son's here. Saya, do you want to see him first? She says, you got this. Say, did you hear that? Your son. She thinks your son is here. Do you want to see his face before you go? Yep, I hear his man voice. Oh, there. she hears the man voice. So you better tell me if you want to see him. Yeah. Saya. Did you already leave, Saya? Would I see if she left? It's all right. She'll say something if she wants to see him. Okay. Got some more, some more wrap lines here from Emiliata. Oh, let's hear it. I don't know if I can get the phrasing on this right. Thank you. Mr. Jingles and Susan sewing on the big screen. Top stitching one off some perfect seam. Yes. I got. I didn't get the beats right. I'm sorry. Yeah, you did. Emiliata, I didn't do your words justice there. Okay, I've sewn up the sides and now I've trimmed the corners here because I'm going to turn it 
And this is like not an actual turn and burn. There's a thing we do called turn and burn. I make my sister say it now every time. This is a baby turn and burn because it's not the whole bag. We don't get a turn and burn on this one. We get to drop it like it's hot in this one. We'll get to that later. Okay, so we're gonna poke out the corners. And I know people have special pokey tools. I also have a special pokey tool. <laughs> Uh, I got it a few years ago <laughs> at birth. Okay. A few years ago. Yeah, a few years ago. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to stitch this bad boy down. I'm just going to base this because we're going to put an accent piece on it in just a minute. I can't believe I'm remembering these steps. Or I'm totally out of order and I'm doing the wrong thing. It doesn't matter. You're, You're going to like it no matter what, right? Yes. I'm going to love it. For those of you who just came, the voice you hear in the back is my friend Shearston. She lives in Las Vegas, which is about two hours from here. And her and her boys are in town for the weekend. And she wanted to come visit. And I said, come on over. I said, hold this computer in your lap and tell me all the comments. <laughs> because we're making a video. <laughs> and I said, I've been waiting my whole life to do this. She's like, what are you doing? Bucket list item complete. And she watched me try to set up the leak, and it was a comedy of errors. Uh, uh, make sure you don't cut your special pokey tool, everyone. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> you know what I have right here, everyone? <clears throat> She's ready. I'm ready. Yep. You live, you learn. Yep. <clears throat> You're following the steps perfectly, and that says. Thank you. I'm not even looking. I just watched the video earlier, and I'm. <clears throat> Every once in a while, I should look though, and make sure I'm doing it right. Okay. Now is the moment where we do this. So this is going to be my accent piece. It's going to go on the slip pocket. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to mark the halfway point. How, okay, is that halfway? It doesn't look Let's like it. Let's see your friend, you don't want to see me, it's okay. They want to see you. Yeah, they said they wanted to see you. Okay, I'm gonna, but, but I'm gonna show first, her. But first, so Terry said, you need to write a jingle for when you are on without Saya. Not the Saya sweat, Saya sweat. Oh, one of just me? Own. I gotta yeah. have my own? You gotta have your own one. Can it include Mr. Jingles, yes or no? <laughs> Can Mr. Jingles be in this? Hey, the Bryce, intro. we named my machine. Is that why you keep saying Mr. Jingles? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure is. that's his name. It's Mr. Jingles. Jingles the Dookie. The Dookie. And guess what it is for short? Mr. Jingles, MJ. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, now Bryce is over there. There's, there's, we're going to have to show this. You can't there's, show it. You can't show it. <laughs> There's pillowcases, but now he's attaching <laughs> tissue paper, saw some tissue paper. Like, oh, underneath the pillowcases to make sure no more of the harsh light comes through. Bryce, that's adorable. Um, Leslie says no half inch. But I was laughing, oh, so I don't know. So I'm not, I'm not supposed to go down the middle and then like... Oh. They said, we want to see Bryce. Too bad. Don't make the man laugh while he's on the ladder, though. <laughs> All right, guys. Okay. We're, we're turning around. First, I'm going to... Yes. Why can't I? The, the people want to see it. Listen, we have to give the people what they want. That's right. Okay. <laughs> Here's Shearston. Am I, are you on there? I can't tell. Yes, I'm on here. Hello. <laughs> She's read the comments for me, and let's see if we can see this. We have a doorway to the bathroom. There's pillowcases hanging down, a bed spread across the shower, and now he's attaching tissue paper to try to block out the light for us. So kind. Everyone says, thank you, Bryce. We love you. Yes. Okay. The camera's not there anymore. You don't have to be shy. Okay. So Leslie said the half will be on the front. The longer side to the back. Oh. So you for sure stitch it on and don't miss, is what she said. 
So, Leslie, you want me to mark a half inch? Okay, I think I understand. Do you want me to read it again? The half inch will be on the front, the longer side to the back. So you first, for sure, stitch it on and don't miss. Oh. Oh, because I'm stitching from the front and I want to catch the back in it. Is that what you're saying? Oh, that doesn't mean anything. <laughs> oh, he's so sad about his tissue paper. It's blowing everywhere. I really wish you guys could see this. He's back up on the ladder. Oh, they appreciate the dedication. I know. I just Leslie his... says yes, and that says ding ding. Okay. Ding 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 with the trolley. Zing zing. With the or bell. What is that from? That's from. Um, um, Meet me in St. Louis. Yeah, meet me in St. Louis. Zing, 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 with my heart string. Good moment, Judy I saw her life They wanted to see you, Bryce. You let the people down. Oh my gosh. They want to see you. It's too late, the camera's already moved. He's being shy. Maybe, maybe another time. <laughs> oh, there's the duct tape. I was looking all over for it. Oops, I was using it for my bag, of course. Susan stole it. Okay, so what I'm going to do, sorry that that took a while for me to understand, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little bit of tape to make sure it goes down, and I'm going to try to keep it out of my seam allowance, actually. I don't know if that's smart or not, but I'm doing it. I'll let you know if anyone... It's too late. It's going oh, on. It's too late. It's too late, baby. It's too late. It's too late, baby. It's too late. Is that Carol King? Maybe. I like her. Yeah. It's a great show. Have you seen Beautiful? I have. I have it. it is so good. I think it's at Tuacon. It was. Is it done now? Yeah. I, my Dang parents it. saw it. They said it was so good. Oh, yeah. Okay. I did say it was Carol King. Thanks, Rosalind. I'm going to do the longer side in the back. The way that she has you mark it has one side longer, one side shorter. And I'm putting a little bit of tape and I'm trying to get the tape off and that's not working. So then I just have to talk nice to it. Come here, little tape. <laughs> what the? Oh. Beep. <laughs> <laughs> I never say the other thing, I just say the what the part. I was just censoring for Thank you. We do need to make it PG. Yes. Shoot, the tape won't come off. Well, should we just do it without tape? <laughs> it's fine, right, everyone? Can I just, like, clip it down? We just love Carol King. That's what we're in the comments right now. Oh, yeah. I, I, I made the distraction. I'm sorry. Good. No, I'm glad you did because I'm struggling over here. I'm just trying to get tape off. Or the, the paper off. Someone showed me at... Texas to put on your nail, stick it on your nail real good, and then pull the paper off. Oh my gosh, it just worked. It worked. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that was incredible. And then I go, okay, and I'm gonna do it again. Okay, all you Carol King lovers, if you have not seen Beautiful, the music, the musical, you need to go see it, or at least go listen to the music. You will love it. Okay, sorry. Never be I don't know a child of mine, I don't think. I'm going to look that one up. Thanks, okay. Wendy. Well, we were discussing Carol King. It took me yes. all that time to do this, so that was perfect. Okay, so now what I'm going to do... No, don't. that was perfect. I'm going to lay this um, slip pocket on my mark that I made. <laughs> Which mark, I wonder? <laughs> hmm. Just a second. Um... Uh, yeah, okay, this one. I'm gonna lay it the best I can. I'm gonna center it because I'm gonna clip the edges in a minute and that'll be fine. And this is just gonna be a nice, beautiful accent piece on the top of this slip pocket. So and I'm gonna go like this. And then I'm going to fold this over. Oh yeah, Tapestry, great album. And as you can see, this accent piece will match our exterior. 
and then I go zoopy zoop, <laughs> doopy doop. That's right. Doopy doopy doop. Okay, and now I'm going to go ahead and I assume top stitch it on. Give me just one minute, please. There's you. Only one minute. Got it. We're going to go ahead and top stitch on the bottom and the top. I think I'll start with the bottom. I'm going to make sure my stitch length is a little bit longer for a top stitch. And I'm going to do this thing. Cindy says, I'm so glad y'all are on. I'm in my home studio sewing and y'all are making it a fun time. Oh, I'm so glad. Heart, heart. Yeah. And Where? Teresa says, hey, Susan, Teresa Monday. Hey, Teresa. We're just in our fancy home studio in the bedroom and bathroom area. Of the That's house. right. With pillowcases and tissue paper hanging down. <laughs> Only the best. Oh. Only the best for... This is your high quality programming tonight. For Susan. Yes. For Susan Pan. For Susan so, Pan. So Susan. Susan Pan. Susan Pan. So can you. Get it? <gasps> That's good. I like that. Now I've gotten everyone on the wanting to listen to Tapestry, the album. That's awesome. It's a great one. I would just like to say that I was born in 1981, and I still love Carol King. Well, she wrote, she wrote so many things. She really did, so so many things. So I'm going to now trim the sides of this. Even with my pocket, and then I'm going to sew up the sides, and I'm going to do a divider. So I'm just gonna mark where my middle is. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna sew onto the lining though, not just by itself. That was almost bad. Don't feel old, Jesse Women. Sixty-five is a wonderful year to be born. I'm sorry, Susan, that I was distracting everyone. Oh no, I actually love it. Are you kidding me? This is what we do. And Sherry says the kids sound like they're having a lot of fun. Oh, oh yeah, sorry. Is it too loud? Well, and I think that is also because of Kasaya's son. He sounds like he's playing with them. He just got home and he's entertaining the masses. Yeah, what a guy. I didn't even start dinner yet or anything. Good for you. You have more important things to do. Like, like make a tote. Like please the people that want to see you. Yeah. You know? Okay, so now you're going to take your other lining, and she does have you make some markings on the linings. And this next marking is so that you know where to line up your slip pocket. So all I have to do now is I have to find my center point on this one, and I'm going to match it up with my center point on my slip pocket. And then I'm going to go zoopy zoop, sew with Mr. Jingles. Don't be a dingle. Don't be a dingle. Don't be a dingle, sew with Mr. Jingles. Yes. You'll make it real nice even if you have to do it twice. <laughs> he doesn't care, just flip your hair. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Jingles. <clears throat> okay. Can repeat that one. <laughs> make that a cadence. Okay, I'm going to look up my seam allowance. How's your shirt? How's your shirt? Hot, cheap, hot. Got it. Okay. <laughs> Don't eat Pringles while stitching with Mr. G. <laughs> <laughs> I like this. You made a, a good choice, Susan. He's a good one, isn't he? Yeah. Okay, so what I'm going to do now, and I probably should have like shown this before I put it down here, but you can see it. I'm going to come down here. I'm going to attempt to do what Kasaya does, which is really dumb because mine will not turn out the same. But I'm going to go like this. And then I'm going to come in and I'm going to go up this line. I'm going to turn it back around and attempt to go down the same line. That'll be exciting. And then I will finish out like this and this and do a back stitch. Carry on. OK. 
carry on, my wayward son. Carry on, my wayward son. <laughs> Give me a word for my It's when you are done. Kansas? Is that the band? No? Um, I'm going to open up. No, I don't know. Yeah, it is Kansas. Nice. Yes. You're amazing. You are amazing. Choo. <laughs> and they're talking about squirrel harnesses. Um, That's because Leslie has squirrels, and it's the strangest yeah. <laughs> thing I've ever seen in my life. Yeah? Okay, I have something to say to, to distract everyone again. I'm so sorry. And that Talk really was, loud. Huh? Talk really loud. Oh, okay. So Annette says she loves the Carry On song. <gasps> yes. Okay, squirrels. This made my brain think of Mark Rober. Okay. If you don't know him, you need to go check out his YouTube channel. He um, is an engineer. He used to work for Apple and NASA. But during the pandemic, he set up all these obstacle courses in his backyard for squirrels. I saw that. Agility I stuff. saw that. Yeah. Yep. And he has, yeah, and the glitter bombs. Yep. He And my, because I have little boys. My boys are 10, 9, and 5. And um, it's such a fun channel to watch. Like, it's a YouTube channel that I don't have to worry about my kids watching unsupervised. So That's awesome. Yeah. You should check him out, Susan. I will. In all your I've spare actually, time. I've actually seen some of his videos. Yeah. And he did a little thing on Amazon Prime, a little series called Revengineers, where they, like... They took people's annoying habits, like not returning shopping carts, <laughs> and then they like, they programmed the shopping carts to like go back to the car where they could. <laughs> Anyways, that's so kind of awesome. It's pretty funny. That's awesome. Oh, and Leslie just put a link to Mark Rover's YouTube yes. channel. Yes. Yeah, he's he's fun to watch. It's like a big kid, but very smart. A big smart kid. A big smart kid. But yeah, he did the, yeah, it was called the Squirrel Game. Someone said that before. Um, it was Leslie that said that, yeah. Gab Gabrielle says you're doing a great center stitch. Oh, thank you. It, honestly, I marked, <laughs> I marked the line crooked, um, but I just went ahead and committed to it, and I also sewed it crooked with the line, so it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. You don't mind, right? Don't, I don't mind. The black and white stripe is from Kasai's closet, right? Um, or she got it from Fabric Therapy. And yes, I got it from her closet. <laughs> sure did. That's what sisters are for. That's right. So we have our two lining pieces done with our slip pocket right here. So Hopefully cute. I didn't sew up the wrong part. There you go. Okay. And with our zipper pocket right there. So cute. Okay, next we're going to assemble these two together. And so what we're going to do, and I'm going to have to look at this part for sure, but we're going to put them right sides together, and we're going to sew down the bottom seam first. So I'm going to go ahead and flip these so they're even. You're, you're being told you look very comfortable sewing tonight. That's oh. been said many times, so... Oh, thank you. I think, honestly, I think that um, Texas Retreat did it. I sat there and sewed for two days straight like a complete lost soul, and I didn't die from it. So now I'm not worried. I'm like, oh, well, if I get it wrong, it's fine. Yeah. Plus, I know that if I have a question, you guys will just tell me what to do. That's right. Okay, so now... We're going to sew along the bottom of this, and I'm going to make sure before I commit to that. I shall now read the instructions. Yes, okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to sew this at the bottom, and then we're going to open it up, open the seams, and top stitch on both sides to kind of open that seam and make it so beautiful. I actually don't know where that particular... I need to measure something. I'm not sure where it is. <laughs> okay. Hmm. 
Okay. Uh oh. Go Look ahead. at those clips. We came a long way, baby. <laughs> Margaret says. Because uh, I used to clip shame me. Because I had like three clips. She came to do a video. Oh. And I had like three clips. She goes, seriously? I said, I'm like, I went. I said, I went to the store and bought clips. It was like a package of five. Yeah. She goes, what yeah. am I supposed to do with five clips? I'm like, I don't know. You yeah, said I don't know, but it's more than I had before. Yep, it's a big collection. <laughs> um, Sarah wants to know if you're going to California with Saya this week. I'm not because it's the same weekend as my daughter's mountain biking um, state championship. <gasps> And she made space. That's amazing. And she's a senior. It's her last season. And I didn't want to miss it. So, um, otherwise, I would have totally gone with her to it. That's awesome. Yeah, it's exciting. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to open up the seams. And I'm not sure how talented I'm going to be at this part. Ooh, my, my back, the bobbin thread's looking a little funky. Should I worry about it? There will be many more retreats in the future, and that says. Yes. There will be, and there won't be any more state finals, right? That is correct. So what we're going to do now is we're going to open our lining pieces together, and I'm going to try to press these seams open the best I can, and then I'm going to flip it over, and I'm going to top stitch so that I can catch these open seams down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Teddy. Aww. He needs to go out. <laughs> okay, bye, Teddy. So I'm going to flip this guy and I'm going to just kind of have to work this so I can keep the seams open, which means I need to put my hands under it a little bit, which frankly sounds a little dangerous for me. <laughs> but you know what? That never stopped me before. Sherry says try twisting your top down a little more. Yes. Thank you, Sherry. I just did. Oh, wait. The top thread? Maybe. Is that what it said? Sherry, what do you mean? Top thread or? Like the top tension? We'll see what she says. Hi, honey. Hi, you doing? I'm doing. I'm helping Susan sew. Oh. Are you having fun? Yeah. All right. Awesome. Susan, is this your first drop in lining? You know, I want to say that one of the bags we did in Texas was a drop in lining. Mm. The backpack was maybe. Mm. Um, and I had help. So this is my first time without someone physically here helping me. Yes. So I'm just holding my hand really tight on the seam to make sure that it's flat. And I'm just going to keep checking with my other hand to make sure that it hasn't gotten caught. So far so good. Ooh, my nails are dirty. Sorry. No, it's okay. Sorry. It's okay. It's her channel. <laughs> she Not said mine. tension. Remember you loosened it. Oh yeah. Thank you. I did just tighten it back down a little bit, so I'm gonna look at the stitching and see. You guys have amazing brain capacity. I know, aren't they awesome? Yes. They're all so nice too. Yes. I'm and I am amazed. Okay. Like no one gets on there and shames me, like, why are you on here? <laughs> Which they could. You, I mean, in all fairness, you could, because this is, <laughs> this is not what you came for. So okay. Fine. Yeah, there you go. So one side, and now I'm going to go and stitch the other one. A secret going on that I can't know. No. Um, Wendy Gibson says it's exactly what I came for. <laughs> you. And then Stitcher says Mr. Jingles likes a little dirty. 
Oh, Mr. Jingles. <laughs> Okay. Boom. Boom. Boom shakalaka laka boom. And now it is top stitched open. Uh, yeah, open. Okay. This wait, I'm sure I have to sew the sides now. Um Stacy is saying I put a piece of washi tape on my machine to make that seam allowance line that is missing. Oh, that's, yeah, that's smart because I couldn't quite figure out where that one was. I said that a little too late. I do have a magnet, but it kind of gets in the way sometimes. Oh. Okay, so this is the part where I have to really think about this because you have to go Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down the side and I'm going to start at a smaller seam allowance and then within an inch I'm going to come out a little bit more so that the lining's not too bunched up. You want it to fit inside your exterior. That's what they say. Part of the noise, that's tissue paper crinkling in the wind over there. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. It's so funny. <laughs> Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, clip your lighting panels together is what Annette said. Thank you, Annette. Clips, clips, clips. Thank you. I was actually just thinking, am I being stupid for not clipping this? Yes. <laughs> yes. Susan is making the fundamental tote, but it's linked higher up in the chat. Yes, it's by Jolie Lee Creations. And there's coupon if you want to buy the pattern. She's giving all of you guys a couple dollars off if you do the code Susan Can exclamation point. Because I think the idea behind this is if Susan can, anyone can. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna start at the top and then I'm going to come out to a bigger seam allowance as I move down about an inch, according to my calculations. says Susan it's like watching your child take their training wheels off watching you sew today <laughs> oh thanks mommy and, and Margaret says oh well I was so impressed a minute ago sewing with no clips I almost cried out loud <laughs> <laughs> spread those wings and fly <laughs> little birdie <laughs> okay I'm dropping things. It's fine. See, my bobbin's looking. Ah, it's loose. I'm gonna tighten it more, maybe. I don't know. I better figure this out before top stitching time, huh? Okay, now I'm gonna do my other. S oh wait, maybe I did it wrong. No, I didn't do it wrong. Okay, now I'm gonna do the other side. I don't know about where you all live, but it is absolutely beautiful here right now. It's my favorite time of year. Yes. It's finally not blazing hot. Us in the desert, when it gets to the finally not blazing hot, yes. we're like, oh, 
know. And then it's nice for like the rest of the year until it gets blazing hot next yeah, summer. That's right. Yeah. It's pretty that's nice. Right. It's beautiful. Some tissue paper just fell. <laughs> the sun's not even yeah, bothering us anymore. I don't think so. I think it's it's fine. It's fine. It was really cute of him to that be concerned so nice. for us. Yes, yes, it was. Okay. Yeah, it's eighty two degrees. See, it's 82 degrees, 82 it's degrees, perfect. and we're like, oh, finally. Oh, yeah, it's like gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah. It's really pretty. Margaret says, if it's loose, just put a second stitch right next to it, just like Oh, I smart. Okay. Us. And then that is saying in Florida, four day? Is that a typo? Yeah, she was Florida. in Florida. Yeah, high tomorrow is 71. Oh. Yeah, that's gorgeous. That's perfect. Gorgeous, gorgeous. 76 in SoCal. Yeah. Yeah, the only thing that we don't get as much here in the West, the trees changing color are more beautiful back east. Agreed. And I can say that because I live in Ohio, northeastern Ohio. Where is Amelia Island, Maureen? 42 in Pennsylvania. Yeah, no thank you. You know what? I need to do one more stitch here. One more stitch. Because that doesn't look great. I'm going to Google Amelia Island. Oh, it's in Florida. Okay. See? You learn something new every day. Northeast corner. Okay. I'm still Googling it so I can see it. Very nice. I see it now. I haven't been to Florida since high school. We have a lot of people in the sewing world that live in Florida. Yeah? How do you guys deal with the humidity? They just stay inside. I don't know what they Susan, do. Susan, you have tightened your thread tension twice. Christine said. Yeah, because the first time wasn't enough. And now it's good. Okay. Well, it's better. I still don't love it. She says it's better. It's better. I don't know what to do. We're just going to keep sewing. It's fine. Okay, so now I'm going to... Lots of hugs. Do I need to trim this? Oh, I need to box the corners now. Okay, so I'm going to box the corners... And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to open this seam. This seam is already sewn open. I'm going to open this seam right here. And I'm going to match my, my seam. So I'm going to match these two open seams so that they are just right across from each other. And I'm going to do a little clippy dippy. They're saying sticky needle maybe too. We hibernate in the center too. Yeah. Out here. Yep. You have to. They said in the winter they sew. <laughs> Good job, ladies. Good job. Okay. I wouldn't like the crocodiles and snakes either. Oh my gosh. With all the, yeah. Kasaya freaks out. Every mention of an alligator or crocodile and she freaks out. It's so funny. Oh man. Okay, so I've got this clipped and ready to go, and I'm gonna sew this, and then I'm going to trim it. I'm gonna squish this bag out of the way here. Squishy squish. <laughs> Brittany says we are ruined Florida for her, for sure. Sending her alligator videos. I know, Brittany. Every time you send her alligator videos, I'm like, they do, they send her alligator videos. I'm like, she's never gonna come see you guys, ever. <laughs> So funny. When you come to Orlando again, and it says you'll all have to visit Gatorland Zoo. Absolutely. With the kids. Wild hogs. Whoa. The sun was coming in. What the? <laughs> so your dad MacGyvered it. Okay. <laughs> That's a little. And now the sun is going away. <laughs> Okay, 
Let's see how the bo bottom's looking. Ugh. It's okay. I still don't love it, but it's okay. All right, and then I have to do a little trim trim. And then we told her that a hurricane was coming and that finished scaring her. Uh-huh. Yeah, no thank you to the hurricanes. We were trying to get out of Florida after one of the expos and we were in the airport as the hurricane was coming. No. And we were stuck right before the tram and they wouldn't let anyone go outside because they said it was too dangerous. And she was like, I got a secret video. Did I ever show you guys this video I got of her? <laughs> we were stuck in the tram area in Orlando airport. And I was just kind of laughing because I'm like, it'll be fine. Like it'll yeah. work out. But she was mad. She was wanting, she was tired, first yeah. of all. But she was also, I think, maybe a little bit worried that the hurricane was going to, you know, be awful. And she was just standing there in a sea of people. And when she saw that I was videoing her, she gave me the best look ever. I do have that video somewhere. And that says I didn't know this. Susan will look for the video, everyone. I will. It'll be a good one. Natalie, that sounds beautiful. She says she's on an island off the west coast of Canada. In line with Seattle. Oh my gosh. It is beautiful up there. Uh, my sister and her wife live there. Where did they live? Oh, in they Washington. Live in, um, where did they just move to? Oh, green. They were in Kent. Um, I'll think of it. It's a pretty area. It is beautiful. Release it on Patreon, <laughs> Leslie said. Okay, deal. <laughs> done. Done. I better hurry and do it before she goes back yeah. and watches this video. That's right. Susan says, done. And Brittany says, yes, Leslie. <laughs> I love it. Federal Way. That's where they live now. Oh, that's cool. Federal Way, Washington. Suzanne Summer died today? <gasps> I'm Googling it. Oh. Now it's just Two's company. Oh, oh no, because Jack Ritter died too, right? I think that he did. Yeah, Jack Ritter died. So yeah. one's not company. So yeah, one's not company at all. Um. Let's see. Okay, now after you do this, you're supposed to trim down the seam allowance on your box corners and also on your side seams. Except what you want to do, and I think I understand this finally. I didn't understand this before. We want to trim down our seam allowance. And before I do this, maybe Leslie still. I, I want to trim this, but I don't want to trim the top part where it's going to be meeting up with the exterior because we want it to be a snug fit at the top. I'm about to do it. Is that the right thing to do? Okay, let me see what anyone says. Gypsy woman says correct, but I don't... Okay, yeah. She's made this a million times. Okay, all right. She's in the summer, she's only 76. That's crazy. That is crazy. Hi! That's my little boy that just walked in the door. How's it going, buddy? Um, Leslie says, yes, yeah, swoop out at the top inch. Why are you on your Because I'm helping Susan. She's sewing the bag. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and then that says, top. yes, trim except for the top inch. Is that okay. what? Yep, that's okay. what I was doing. Okay. Okay. It is trimmed, sewn, boxed, and there's one last thing that we're going to do. I'm going to put some double-sided tape right here on this line that I've drawn. And I'm going to be folding down. Um, I want to open this seam here, actually. Okay, and I'm going to be folding down this to meet that line. And that's so that when we do the drop-in lining, we won't have a raw edge on the top. At least that's what they say. That's what they say. That's what they say. Mm -hmm. Sherry, look what I'm using. Sherry made that for me. Thanks, so Sherry. So cute. Oh, and my pouch swap. Jennifer, I wait to show you what we're snacking on. Jennifer was my swap in Patreon, and this was inside of it. Thanks, Jennifer. <laughs> I haven't had M&M's in forever. 
best. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Linda says hi from Michigan. Oops. Hi. I've only been to Michigan once, and it was beautiful. It is pretty. That's where Dax Shepard is from. Great podcast. I have never listened to his podcast. It's called Armchair Expert. Um, but on Fridays he does one called Armchair Anonymous, and it's so funny. Funny, funny stories. That's cool that you guys do a swap. You guys are cute. It's cute, right? We just we yeah. just are at the very end of it. Sherry says, "Yay! I'm so glad you used your cup. I love my cup." I'm sure I'm sure he's the one who showed up with the shirt. Oh, well, Doc Shepard went to your high school? What? Before you were there. That's he's so cool. funny and he's so intelligent. He was an anthropology major. Oh, was he? Yeah. <clears throat> I've got an M&M stuck in my throat. Oh, uh oh. <laughs> <clears throat> Everything's fine. There you go. Better? Better. Okay, so now I'm just going to go ahead and take part of the tape off. I'm going to open this seam right here. I'm going to open this guy. <clears throat> wow. Maybe it's still in my throat. <laughs> Sweet. <clears throat> I'll get some more. I bet it's fine. You can finish that one. Okay. And then I'm going to... I don't actually know if I'm doing this right, but... I'm going to try to fold that down. <clears throat> I'm not crying, I promise. <laughs> I'm going to fold this down at the, at the line that you draw <clears throat> at the very beginning, just to give you a nice finished edge at the end for our top stitching step. And then I'm going to open this other seam and go bada bing, bada boom amazing so amazing sherry wants to know if you use the soap uh yes sherry makes homemade soap and it smells so oh, good okay. oh thank you oh, she's choking on m and i think he knows he must know okay <laughs> thank you he came in to resuscitate bryce was listening in the other room <laughs> thank you uh, yes. rosalind said you need another m and though <laughs> you know Husband to the rescue. Yep. Looking like a pro, Liz says. Well, you must have not seen the strap at the beginning. <laughs> I just threw it aside and we just went on. <laughs> we have no straps. Okay, it's fine. Can, it's I, fine. can I just use webbing? Okay, this is my last step for my lining, and then all I have to do is assemble my um, exterior parts together. I just have to sew across the bottom, just like I did on this one. Um, <clears throat> open up the seam and top stitch, sew the sides, box the corners, and then do this right here. And then we're gonna drop the lining inside the top, stitch it together. Bada bing, bada boom. Yeah. Daydream Believer says you've come so far. Well done, you. Oh, thank you, you. Okay. We have an inside out lining. If I were to stop right now, would you be happy to have this bag? <laughs> just like that? Just like this. It's amazing. Thank you. Truly. And just for that, Leslie I will keep Leslie says going. no webbing. I have to do it, don't I? Leslie, I'm going to have to actually try that strap. I have to rip that whole thing, though. Ugh. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Leslie, how come you won't let me use webbing? All right. It won't work, I know. The whole point of the tote is it's got this incredible handle and the straps and... Okay. 
As Sire says, almost done. Well, she does say almost done right here. But let's be honest, how long have I been on? Oh my gosh, it's been two hours. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Did you need to be anywhere? Nope. Because here we are. Oh, great. I'm surprised your boys aren't like, let's go. I know, right? Yeah. We're halfway there. Oh, okay. Mr. Hopefully I don't get too um, confident and miss something important. So now I'm sewing the bottom. If I should not sew the bottom, well, you know, here's the problem though. I think my Decaville is in my seam. That's going to be a problem isn't it should I peel it away and trim it a little bit because I think it's it's doesn't give me enough space you see what they're saying should I trim it away a little bit um, Tammy they're saying so generous and I'm not sure it is because I'm not familiar but maybe she made a donation or something <gasps> or what says oh my gosh that was so nice. Yeah, for Susan. Thank and you. So everyone is saying that that was so kind of them. That was so kind. And it is. It is so kind. So very kind. And Tammy says, thank you. I just love these two. Oh, <laughs> you're so sweet. That oh my so gosh. That's so sweet, Tammy. You made, you made Susan's day. You did. I'm just trying to help out Susan. Well, she's fabulous. Um. Okay, so they're saying... Um, no different seam allowance. Okay. So right next to it. Okay. If it's not in your seam, you will be fine. Okay. Different seam allowance, Susan, from both Leslie and Annette. That won't mess it up later? Yeah, All and right. I said don't peel it. Okay. Got it. Thanks, guys. Yes, Tammy, Susan is, she always makes me laugh. <laughs> And always makes me smile. Guaranteed. Oh, stop it. She's a joy. She's a gift to this world. Okay, you can stop now. No, she's not even paying me either, guys. I don't need to be paid to speak the truth. Oh my gosh, I'm so sure. <laughs> Um, they're saying they think your machine would sew over the Decaville. Oh, okay. I would sew is as is, and open up the top seam and top stitch. Okay. So I just sewed right next to it. So I just kept it right out of it. I'll show you. I was able to just miss it. Okay, so now I'm going to open this up and I'm gonna go squishy squish, open, open, squishy squish. Yeah, the same words. Squishy squish, open, open, squishy squish. What you gonna do? You're gonna open that seam. You got a top stitch. You got a top stitch. That's right. Okay. It's a slightly smaller seam, so I just have to make sure it's not. Um, Annette says change your stitch length to top stitch. <gasps> Thank you, Annette. Um, Thank and you. they're making compliments to you on the color for the outside. Oh, thank you. Uh, pairing with the stripes. Oh, thank you. Yeah. And that you're a bag sewing master. Well. You better get that channel going. Nope. <laughs> this is the only channel you'll ever see me on, folks. And that's only if she doesn't change her passwords. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say? She's going to be like, um, access denied. Uh, access denied. <laughs> As her ratings start going down, <laughs> people start unsubscribing. <laughs> You've gone too far. <laughs> I lose all her business. Stacy says to tell you, home stretch. 
Oh, home stretch. Because Kasaya always says, home stretch. We're almost done. I'm like, we are not almost done. You're such a liar. That's just like when you're at the gym or you're in the, and they're like, right. two more. Two more. You're like, you already said and they two keep more. Saying uh -huh. that. You're like, liar. Lies. Lies. You sit on the throne of lies. <laughs> Leslie says, make sure to like the video so Kasaya knows she needs to come back. But not before we post the video or picture to Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm going to share this channel with my mom because she's a really good sewer. So we'll try and get Saya to 40K. Let's do it. She is very, very close. She is close. We need to get her there. Yeah. I'm going to share with my mom and she'll watch. I love this fabric. It's really pretty. It's gorgeous. You did a good job. It was my first time being a big girl and buying my own <gasps> vinyl. Good job. There's banging noises. Should we be worried about that? I don't know. Whatever. No one's screaming, so. I feel like I should know this reference, but I don't. You smell like beef and cheese. <gasps> yep. Oh. See, because I said you sit on a throne of lies, oh. and that's from Elf. <laughs> and they were finishing oh, 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 oh. that. You smell like beef and cheese. Good job, Natalie. Okay, so I have opened that and top stitched it. Now we're going to come back to together, and I'm going to um, clip and sew up the sides, making sure that my... Um, top inch of the side is that a different seam allowance than the rest of it no just kidding how embarrassing that's only for the interior give me a minute please Charlie Brown's teacher is back in business um, okay here it is okay Nope. Yes. Okay. This is all with the same seam allowance, of course. How embarrassing. She didn't even need to be reminded to use the clips, guys. Amazing. I do learn. Not fast, but I do learn. She's a really fast learner. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm actually gonna put this double-sided tape first for folding down, because that was kind of hard to do once I sewed that shut. Live and learn, baby. <laughs> All this says to go back to your regular stitch. Oh, oh my gosh, thank you. See, <laughs> there. <laughs> You guys are awesome. <laughs> I'm just putting this double-sided um, tape for, for the next step when I fold things down because the last time I, w I sewed up the sides and then did the tape, and so it was actually kind of hard because it wasn't laying flat anymore. So I'm gonna do it this way so that while it's laying flat, oh, just kidding, I don't want it on the edge. Ignore that part. I'll go back and fix that. Isn't your maiden name Sure? It is. Mm -hmm. Hain? Hain. Yeah. That's Hain. my sister in law. Your sister in law. I'm sorry. Hain. I think she's in Korea right now. I'm Hi, sorry, Hain. Hain, that I just destroyed your name. Hi, Hain. Are you still in Korea? She's visiting her, her mom. Oh, how fun. And oh, think. sister in law in the house. <laughs> hey Shern, how's all your delicious Korean food? Is it wonderful to be home? Good she job. got to go see her mama. How nice. And all her brothers and sisters and nieces and nephews. Her whole family lives over there. I bet she misses them. I'm sure she does. Yeah. 
But she married my brother, so that was a choice, wasn't it, Hayne? <laughs> you didn't ask me. I could have saved you. I love it. Just kidding. He's a pretty good guy. He's a keeper, that one. He's the most chill, nice person you'll ever meet, honest. Okay. Um, they're asking me if I sew. No. My name is Sherston, and if you spelled it wrong, I wouldn't be mad at you because it's spelled... It's a Swedish name, so. KJ. Yep, KJ. Oh, Heinz says she came back last night. Oh, okay. Bet you're tired. Yeah. Glad you're safe. Welcome back to the States, Hain. Yes. I'm glad you got to go. I can't wait to hear about it. Ah. It's pulling all weird because the clips. Mm. Yeah, it's spelled K J E R S T I N. You can type it in the chat if you oh, want to. So type can see it. it. Yeah. It'll be under. It'll be under it'll my be under name. Your name. Yeah. My mom is a really good seamstress, so I've learned a few things from her here and there, but I'm like a um, hundred steps below Susan in skill level. I doubt that. <laughs> it, my bottom, the bottom still doesn't look great. What should she do, ladies? I don't know. Should I crank it some more? I'm afraid my top stitching is not going to go well. Yes, the KJ is a SH sound. Yep. Hi. How are you doing? Susan is surrounded by people with unique names. Yes, I am. Can you? Yeah, can you pick those up? Okay, here? Christine says top feed dog pressure. Decrease it. Oh my gosh, things are falling so everywhere. Or maybe now. the oh, pressure okay. foot. Or before you top stitch, test on a scrap. Okay. Check your tension. These are all the suggestions. Okay. Reset and check your bobbin. Oh, that's what I'll do. Okay. I'm gonna do that right now, actually. Another comment about the bobbin, so. I actually She's... wonder if I should wind a new one before I top stitch. That's the only thing I, you guys, I've never top stitched before. Um, the drop in lining at the retreat, I knew the machine wouldn't be able to handle it and, and I didn't want to ruin it, so I just didn't top stitch it. And the other bag I made, the, the Aries, I also decided I didn't want to ruin it, so I didn't top stitch it. So that is the thing that I have never done. This okay, way. so Vicky says I would use the walking foot to sew the drop-in lining. Uh, for sure, ha for sure, have a new bobbin ready. Um, Could I use the walking foot on the top stitching? I wonder if I could even fit it under there. And then Stacy says to sew a second row of stitching just outside of your side seams. Okay. So thread doesn't show on the vinyl. Out, right outside of it. So on. So I should sew another row towards the edge, but right next to it, right? Is that what she's saying? Okay, let's see. I think so. Yeah. So I'll read it to you again. Sew a second row of stitching just outside of your side seams. 
Okay. So thread doesn't show on the vinyl. Okay. And Annette says, but start an inch down. Walking Oops. foot can sometimes chew up the vinyl. Oh, now I'm scared. Right? Okay. <laughs> uh. Margaret says, right next to it. Okay. And Dalva says, don't be scared. Too That's late. I'm already scared. <laughs> I'm already feeling feelings. You can't see her shaking. She's not shaking, guys. She's got this. Susan is an amazingly quick learner, Sherry says. Oh, and Annette says, don't do it all the way to the top. So you can still open your seam. Did I read that too late? Shoot. So maybe I didn't read my instructions right. Um, don't go all the way to the top. Oops. I need to rip it then. My daughter came in and she dropped my instructions on the floor. Oh, she did. So now they're all out of order. Uh-oh. Give me just a minute. Uh, Annette says, it's not a deal breaker. It is just easier not to. Well, Annette, I've gone and done it. And they said, it should, Gypsy Woman, that's Wendy, right? Yeah. She says it should be fine. Okay. And that means your second row of stitching don't go all the way to the top. Oh, gotcha. Did you. you just do the first one? Nope, I did both. Awesome. <laughs> It's fine, it's fine. So if you haven't made this before, I'm having a little I'm having a little bit of a problem getting the material not to shift because I've got the hardware on the inside and so it's wanting to pull weird. And so that's why I'm kind of going a little bit slow when you see me using the stiletto because I'm I don't want the layers to shift. Um but they don't care what I want, they're just shifting anyways. <laughs> She came in and she dropped everything and I don't know where anything is. Oops, oh. I'm gonna kick that. Oh, there it's it is. It's fine, no need to seam rip. <sighs> okay. Um. Let's see. I lift the other side of the bag while I'm sewing, Rosalind says, and then they said also to clip the top to hold it. <gasps> oh. Okay, okay, okay. I see what you're saying. You ladies are so helpful. Are they the best? So smart. So kind. Like, I'm not sure why you're watching this. Is this painful for so you guys? So resourceful. I know. You're, you're so entertaining. Smart. You're fun. Do <laughs> do <laughs> All right. Rosalind said she's sewing it with you. We're <gasps> in this together. Yes, you are, Rose. Okay, I have to see your final product for sure. Yes. Okay. Um, okay, everything's fine. Oh, and lift it. Oh, so it doesn't pull. Oh, yeah. genius. That totally fixes it. You guys are amazing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The mm -hmm. best. Okay. And that is reassuring you it's not painful because there are people at your level and they'll have to start somewhere. Okay, well... Here we okay, are. Sherry's got to go. <gasps> Sherry, I love you. I'm sorry. She that has took jury so long. duty tomorrow. She said oh, that earlier. I know. You do? Like, do you have to stay for sure or you just have to show up? My I husband have loves jury duty. He loves it when he gets called to do that. I get called every year right around Christmas and then they never want me. <gasps> rude. Right? Yeah. So rude. So, yep, Cynthia says you're very entertaining. And you are an inspiration. You're the meaning in my life. You're the inspiration. You're the meaning to my life. You're the inspiration. When you love somebody. <laughs> to the end of time. Okay, the stitching looks better, so I'm going to leave it with one. Okay, so now... I'm going to open this baby up, match up my seams, and box the corners. It's getting very exciting in here. 
Cindy says the entertainment world may have lost Suzanne Summers, but we have the new Susan <laughs> <laughs> to entertain us. Yes. Just <laughs> as talented, I'm sure. I love it. And then Annette filled in with our singing. To the end of time. That makes me want to go play some Chicago on the piano. Know, right? I'm going to. I'm going to go play Chicago on the piano when we're done. I want you to play on your horn 25 or 6 to 4. Come on. <laughs> That's a good one. It is a good one. It's a bummer because YouTube will, will flag us if we do too much of anything. Oh, right? Okay. We're okay. okay. But I'm okay. just saying, like, I can't actually play my instruments for them ever. Oh, Because it'll flag us for um, copyright stuff. Oh. We yeah. need to stop then. Uh, no, we do that stuff all the okay. time. Okay. I just mean I can't go play a full song. When I was in marching band, we played 25 or 64 because we did. Who didn't play that? That's Chicago right. Chicago songs. It's yep. a great song. Yep. You know? Mm -hmm. Natalie says we're Chicago without the horns. I know. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Guys, you need to come visit Susan. Play her horn. She's amazing. Nah. Yeah, Chicago's a great band. They're awesome. Yes, yes, yes. You know who else uses brass that's good that um, I love because of my parents is Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Oh, I don't know them. You don't know them? Nope. Okay. I'm going to find a song. Okay, do it. Yep. But just don't play it yet. I won't play it yet. Flagged. Yeah, we don't want to get flagged. Okay. Oh, yeah, America's a good band, too. Should I to should I shoes. trim the exterior too, or was that just for the lighting? Okay. Let's see. My papers are out of order, and I can't find the paper that tells me. Like, am I supposed to trim my box corners? They're not sewing while we wait. Um, what lamp are you using? They want to know. Um, it's my mom's old ot light. Well, this is just some lights on here, but there's an ot light right here. Um, Wendy says she trims hers. If Wendy trims hers, then I'm trimming mine. <laughs> right, um, Wendy? Rosalind says trim exterior the same way. Okay. And that says yes, trim. Okay, thank you, people. Yeah. I knew you'd know. Yeah. It's like I can show up and not know anything, and they're like, do and this. I'm like, okay. you, you're like, mm -hmm. awesome. Although I did try to study a little bit for this. You did so good. I'm sending you my favorite song okay. of Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Good. I want to hear it. Why is that not lining up? <gasps> Did I line it up wrong? Um, I do like to do a second row on the corners. Mom, can I have oh, okay. Yes, you've made me so very happy. Yep. So, Terry, that's Mom, a great song. One? Uh, Margaret says wait. Okay. Yes, Susan. you can. Yep, yep. Huh? Spinning Wheel's a great one, too. Yeah, you can have it. Here, I'll eat it. He said it's a bit fat chunky. <laughs> it's a bit fat. Yeah. Trim only the box corners. And not the sides. Says, I don't think you trim the side seams. Okay. For the exterior. Okay. Thank and you. So Terry is saying you have to top stitch. Well, mine's yours. Those are Susan's and you've got enough. That's a handful. My five-year-old is... He found the M&M's. Stealing some M&M's. I like it. I yes. like it. Are you five already? He is five. Oh my five word, dude. Come on. That's crazy. At the end of the month. That's crazy. Five and a half. I know. You can use a stapler inside the seam allowance to match up. If I have one. Oh, yeah. I don't have one. Sadie. Saya said she bought me one. That's right. She did say And she that. was going to bring it, but she got sick. Yeah. She just messed everything up. Oh, Huey Lewis and the News is a great band, too. Oh, they're great, yeah. They, they had horns, too, right? Yeah. 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 There was a lot of bands in that era that did. That did, yeah. yeah. Yep. Huey Lewis is a great band. Oh, by the way, also, side note, if mm -hmm. you guys have not checked out, there's an app called Music League, and it's something you can play with your friends or coworkers, and you all submit songs on certain themes and then you vote. I've been doing it with my oh, family. Oh, that's so cool. It's very fun. And plus it introduces you to new music too. That's really cool. I like that. Yeah. 
Yeah. Um, more clips, Denise says. I'm having a hard time with, and I'm going to show you guys what's happening with my clips. And so I keep just taking my clips off. Um, let me show you. Let me get this out of the way because maybe those of you who have the same machine can tell me what I can do. So I clip stuff and as I run it across here and here, this plate right here grabs the clip and it just keeps scooting the clip away. It won't let the clip come up and over the thing. And so that's why I keep taking the clips off. I'm not sure what to do about that. Let me do another a second stitch real quick. They keep on saying top stitch. Oh, <gasps> shoot. Oh, I did. Okay. Do you um, mean top stitch this? I did that. Okay. So Vicky said your two center seams. Um, Linda says I trim in the middle of the side seams. Butterfly the bottom and top. Okay. I actually know what that means. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, she doesn't have a stapler. Kasaya has one for her, but um, not here yet. No, the app is called Music League. Um, L-E-A-G-U-E. -E. You can type it in there. Okay, yeah, I'll type it in. Check out the app, though. Um, it's a free app. Um, my brother started it because he played it with some of his colleagues at work. But it's really fun. Um, Cynthia says this, that happens to me. I just hold it up a little to get past these bumps. Okay. And that says you're right on track with the pattern. Okay. So. Donna says her clips get stuck and slide also. She says, I just watch now and pull it off. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. So. The clips only do good up until a certain point yeah. and then they, they come right off. Yeah. Okay. Oops. Sorry. Bump that. Is everyone doing okay? I should drink some water. Yes, drink. Stay hydrated. Stay hydrated for all this very, very hard work. Okay. Yes. What was I going to do? Oh, I was going to trim this side. Um, Leslie is saying... She wonders if a little bit of washi tape or something would let it slide over. Like if you put it on oh, the machine. Oh, that's a good idea. The machine. Yeah, that's a great idea. Um, I'll have to try that because I've been having that problem and I wasn't quite sure what to do. And then it says, now you are really in the home stretch. Whatever, Leslie. <laughs> All right. So some say trim, some say don't. I'm just going to move on with life. Okay. So I'm going to open this side seam up hopefully take this sticky part off without too much pomp and circumstance. Oh, it's not working again. I'm going to do the nail trick. Oh my gosh, it totally works. That's Ray taught me that. Two times now. Two times. Fail. Miracle. It's just a double sticky tape miracle. Miracles. Okay, I'm going to open this. Oh, that sounded rough. I'm sorry. It's probably my children. But no one's screaming, so I'm no. just I'm just amazed. Wait, am I doing this right? Margaret says it's almost time to turn and burn. Except Margaret, it's a it's a drop in lining. Oh, I do have to turn this part. You're right. I get to say it. Do I get to say it? Does it count as a turn and burn if I'm only turning the exterior? <laughs> because I would really like to turn and burn. Brittany says, Margaret, this time it will be a drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> drop it like it's hot. <laughs> yep, it's true. I love it. I love it. And yes, there are children outside. They're, they're my children. My three boys. And they're happy. They are. They're having a great time. So we're happy. That's right. They don't mind, they say. I'm actually surprised all of our kids haven't come in more. I know, right? Like, why are you guys still in here? They don't care. They don't. They're just like, oh good, they're still in there. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I actually get worried when I don't hear my kids. Yeah. I'm like, it is too, it's too quiet. Yep. Something is happening. They've done something. <laughs> uh, Margaret says, put a clip on the side seam to hold it while you stick down the rest. Thank you. That's exactly what I'm going to do, Margaret. Margaret's my girl. Thank you, Margaret. Two gold stars for you. <gasps> Yes. Yes. Definitely gets those. I'm not sure. <laughs> did you hear that? I did. Oh, I forgot to take the paper off though. It looks so good, Susan. I'm so impressed. Don't be impressed yet. Oh, we didn't yeah. we didn't finish it. And this is your purse and your strap is over there in shambles, so <laughs> I don't know how you can hold this thing. <laughs> oh yes, Matthew, you have four boys. God bless you. Silence is horrifying. Sure it is. When Julie says, when I was a kid and we were having fun playing, we would hide from our mom so we could play longer <laughs> or ask for a sleepover. Yep. I love it. Oh, your boys gave each other haircuts, Wendy. Oh, my gosh. Um, knock on wood. Mine have not done that yet. Oh, you just said it. They're going to do it now. I know, right? Okay. But, oh, my gosh, you guys. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Guys, she does, she's... Okay, it's a half turn and burn because it's not the full thing. So we're going to half turn and burn this baby. And then we're going to drop the lining in like, like it's, it's hot. hot. Okay. Did I miss anything? I feel like I should be doing something else. They said, Julie says it looks amazing and it really does. Would you accept the bag if this was the finished product? Just like that? Yep. Sure would. Because your hands touched it. <laughs> yes, they did. It's worth something, you guys. Something. <laughs> <laughs> it's worth it's worth cash monies. Yeah. It's worth you driving here to visit me, right? <laughs> even even if I didn't get it, it's worth it to visit. <sighs> <sighs> Getting her workout at the end of the day. Donna says looks incredible. It really does. Just a minute, I've got to fix this. They're getting crazier out yes, there. They are. The natives are starting to get restless. They are. Good thing we are almost there. We sure are. Okay, and then you want to poke your corners out, which you all know, but I'm pretending like I'm teaching someone. Am I teaching anyone? No. <laughs> Once again, um, there's tools you can buy for corners, or you can use that. <laughs> yep. <laughs> they use the ring. It's a little wrinkly now that I turned it. It'll come out, right? It's fine. So cute. Guys, look at what she did. It's really cute. It's darling. Okay, I think I'm supposed to put... I think I need to put some sticky tape to hold the corners together, maybe. I don't know. Alright. Um, she says... Oh, to straighten it out, you can use a blow dryer. Okay. Mm, nice. Someone says it's the Decaville, and that said that. Oh, uh, shoot. Well, it's fine. It's, it's fine. character. Okay. Right. I assume it doesn't matter which way I go. All right, everyone, we're going to drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Yeah, Susan picked a beautiful color. It, guys, it's, it's like a, it's more like a green. Yeah. The light's a little weird, but yeah. it is, yeah, the light's really funky. Yeah. There. Is that better? Yeah. 
Yeah, it's a green. Um, Sunrise CC Shop says she loves your sense of humor. Oh, thank you. That's true. If you don't have humor, well, then life's rough. Sure is. It's rough anyways. And we have some emojis with the fingers. Best tool. Best, Best tool. tool. Yep. Okay. I am thinking of putting, stop me if it's stupid, but I'm thinking of putting sticky tape in between my sides. What are your thoughts, folks? Or should I just clip it a lot? It is kind of like a teal color. It, yeah, it's like, it's like a teal. But more green than blue. We'll take a better picture of it. I know the light's weird right now. Yeah. It said, they said don't put it in your seam line. Okay. I um, also want to say the ironing board for the wrinkles. Um, she's, Leslie says you can do it as long as it's lower than your top stitch. You know what? So you said I clip it. We're going to clip it like it's hot. Clip it like it's hot. Someone said no DST. Okay. We're lots of opinions. I'm sure there's a million ways, and I'm just going to clip the heck out of it. How's that sound, everyone? There you go. Uh, Wendy says she clipped hers, and it was fine. Okay. We're going to call this step click the heck out of it. <laughs> Mr. Jingles is waiting for his big moment, his very first top stitching of a bag moment. Yeah. Clips seems to be popular. Okay. Well, let's do that then. So what I'm doing is I'm lining up the side seam once again, as if I'm teaching at least one person, although you've all made this and I haven't, but I'm lining the side seam first. And I'm trying to make it so that, I mean, I want to make my layers even, but if anything, I think I want my outer, my exterior slightly higher. I don't want the interior poking up over. So I'm just kind of making sure that, yeah. So that if anything, the interior is slightly below. I don't know if that's the right way, but that's the way I'm doing it. Clip it real good. Crafty Lee's joining from Delaware. Nice. Delaware. Oh, that's beautiful there right now. Oh, I bet. And yes. Take a little drive. Um, Dina says, this is when a cylinder sewing machine would come in handy. Yeah. That's not going to happen for me, people. <laughs> I've already taken an entire room of the house with my instruments, so... <laughs> My husband literally has his office in a closet downstairs. He does. And he works for Molly. He works downstairs in a closet with no windows. So I can have this room, from the other room for my music room. So I cannot be <laughs> also doing this sewing room. Oh. Which is why I have my sewing machine on a table that's on wheels right here in my bedroom. And I usually wheel it over into the music room. But for those of you who didn't hear before, we have some guests staying right now. Kasaya's son and his son's girlfriend are here and the girlfriend gets the guest room so yes okay um so it's been suggested a couple times now taking the extension table off to top stitch will help okay um and leslie also says at the same time a few people took their table off and hung the machine a bit over the edge oh. of the table. Oh, I see what you're saying. And Stacy said she takes the table off when she does this part as well. I'll try so. taking the table off and see if that works. If not, I can, I can lift this down and scoot it to the edge. I'm a little nervous that this, so here's the thing about this last step. This could ruin the whole thing but you also have to do it in order to attach the back. Yeah. Are you ready for this risk? I'm ready. I'm ready to accept this risk. You accept? I accept. Okay. 
Jamie says I bought a whole house just to have a sewing needle. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Um, and it says don't forget a fresh bobbin and test the tension one more time. Oh, thank you. Okay. Think positive. You can do this. Rosalind says. Okay, Rose. <laughs> I'm actually kind of. This is the first time tonight that I'm feeling. I'm feeling some feelings. Some nervous feelings. Send those Care Bear stares. <laughs> the good vibes. <sighs> She's got this. I mean, we could just super glue it down. We could. And then I wouldn't have to take the risk. But look how many clips you have. I mean, look at that. Do you like that? That's amazing. Let's just leave it like that. <laughs> but then you wouldn't have any clips. And that would be sad. That would be so sad. Yes. Hashtag Susan can. Exclamation. <laughs> Let's start a movement. You know what? Give me just a second, everyone. I'm going to wind a new bobbin just to be safe. Okay, our stairs on their way. We have faith in you. We've got this. Slow and easy. Oh, what? This old thing? Just a bag, I mean. Just a bag, I mean. NBD. NBD. <laughs> no big deal. Okay. Goodbye, table. Um, okay, so Margaret says before you start your top stitching, push lining down as flat as you can to the bottom. Okay. This will help it not to come out over the exterior. Don't get in a hurry. Okay. Um, someone said you need less clips, space to get your needle in. And then the next person says the more clips, the better. Well, I'm going to have to take them off to get the needle, but I'm just yeah. clipping it all right now. Then I'll have to take a chunk of it off, right, to get the needle in. And I should probably raise this guy, right? Should I raise this? Um, press your foot? Ooh, and that, I'm glad you told me to change my bobbin because that might not have made it. That would have been so sad. Good job, Annette. And that's the best. Three gold stars for you. Ooh, that's the most that's been awarded tonight. I know, right? I need to, I need to keep a tally. Like, I'm going to be doing this again. <laughs> <laughs> you might. You might just say, I've got to go to St. George to do a video. I've got to go to St. George to do a video, guys. <laughs> it's very serious. <laughs> very important. Oops. Uh, oh, I'm feeling nervous. Deep breaths. <sighs> That's right. Uh oh. I can't even blame it on Gabriella. She's not in here. <laughs> oh, no Bob and Chicken tonight. That's right. stars in the chat, Brittany. <laughs> Love those gold stars. We should probably plug it in. Okay. Grab it just a minute. Stay down there. Mine likes to hop. Nope, stay down. It likes to hop up. It's a hopper. Hippie hop. It's a hopper. <laughs> We got Mr. Jingles for the topper. The top stitch coming up, coming your way. We took the table off, okay. Uh, now we're gonna wind the bobbin because we don't want to run out. We don't want 
not anything that really rhymes with bobbin. Throbbin. 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 How can we incorporate that? Sobbin. Because sobbin. we don't want to be left sobbin. There when the go. thread runs out, that'll be so sad. And we'll get really mad. So we're going to want a brand new bobbin from Mr. Jingles, Mr. Jingles. Yes. Love it. All right. Yeah, we don't want the bobbin to go flying. We don't want it stopping. That's a good one. Oh, yes. That's, look, that's good. We gotta find the bobbin. Really, yeah, it says, did you make stuff. sure it sits down on that little pin? So it sits on and then. The winder? Yeah, I put it on the yeah. pin, and then every time I start going, it pops up. So I just put my finger on it and I go slow down, and it works enough. It works ish. Test on scraps, they said, if you want. Oh, that's a good idea. Okay. Yeah, I better do that. Oof. I'm feeling some things. It's good. Sit in them. Sit in the feelings. Feel your feelings. Feel them. My feelings tell me you're scared. But we're not going to die, so. Well, we might ruin your bag right now, though. And there's only how many people watching? Oh, only 130. A hundred people have left because well, this is, oh, 240. 241. Oh, shoot. Yeah. No, nope, there's a lot of people. Yeah. It's because you're amazing. Mm. Okay. Just a second. Everyone's here. <sighs> okay. Yeah, let me get a scrap. Watching with bated breath. Ignore the stuff that's back here. That wasn't supposed to be on camera. <laughs> Why did I put that on? That's the first time I've seen it. Everyone's cheering you on. We've got this. My son is in marching band and is practicing his tuba. Yes. Playing Lexington March. Yes. Like a soundtrack to your sewing right Oh now. my gosh, I love that. Love it. Oh, he's <sighs> tuba. Yep. He's gotta be strong too. It's awesome. And five thumbs up for Susan. Five thumbs from up. From So Terry. Mm-hmm. Yes. Terry. Oh wait. Go go go, Susan! Oh, you know what to say. Double that piece so you can test it. She I said. did. I oh. doubled it. And that it's like you sent her the message and she received it before you typed it. You guys, I think it's okay. Yeah. Okay. But then Leslie says Joey asked earlier if you could teach him tuba. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. I'll teach him any instrument he wants. That's right. I told you guys about my daughter. My 12 year old has been wanting to learn an instrument. And so I said, I'll teach you any instrument you want. And we were, we were in the music room and I have like every instrument. I'm like, do you want to play the trumpet? Do you want to play the flute, clarinet, saxophone, French horn, euphonium, trombone? I'm naming all the instruments. Yeah. She said, no mom, I want to play the recorder. Can you teach me the recorder? I'm like, sure. So I bought a recorder book and we're learning the recorder. <laughs> oh, God bless you. Do you put earplugs in? No, nah, I just lean in. Mm, good job. Okay. Mm. Julie says make it thicker to match lining and exterior thickness. Oh. So I'm not done testing. Should I test more? Does she need to test more, guys? No comments yet. It looks good on two layers and four layers. All right. All right, everyone. Dun 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 dun
What's okay. in the corner? It's um. <laughs> it's a thing you learn like in fourth grade. It's like a. Yeah. And it's yeah. squeaky and yeah. whatever. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to start. I don't know where I'm going to start. Oh. It's the final countdown. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Wait, how do I do this? How in the world do you fit that in there? Oh, I see why people hang it over the edge. We're doing it. Okay. Oh, I can't do that. I can't reach it right. No, we're just, we're just, it's going to be okay. And then they're asking about your chair. Is it office chair or sewing chair? Oh, it's just an office chair. It's an office chair, and I just roll it in from the other room when I sew. I really don't have a sewing space. Although, I'm starting to take over more and more spaces because I'm getting more stuff. <laughs> and now I, our whole closet's taken over, and I need to get something. Okay. Oh, gosh, I'm so nervous. Um, Wendy okay. says, I top stitch from the inside. Uh, Dalva says, in a seam, I raise it with books or something. Mm. Um, Roslyn says, I sew it from the inside on the lining. Um, Cindy says, start where it will not show when you back stitch to finish. Mm. Um, Barb says put something under the legs by the needle if you want to lift the machine up. Oh, okay. I'm understanding this. Let me grab some books. Uh, I have this. Someone else said books under it. Put the machine up on books. Erase it with blocks or dictionaries. Give me just a minute. I get what you're saying. She's got to go get some more things to lift it up. Yeah. To Susan, yeah, look at this bag she's made. Isn't that awesome? A lot of people are saying so from the inside. Really? Yeah, here. But this one would be the purpose to throw this away. Yeah, I don't know. You can just use your knee lift. One sits up on the books. Your friend uses her yoga blocks. Do you need help? saying that's perfect. Okay. Lots of yeses with exclamations. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh dear. That is so Please funny. Please excuse my children are about to uh, They just realized we're doing a YouTube video. Oh, we'll just we'll yeah, just walk in videos. nonchalantly. Here, if you guys will wait, I'm gonna do this last one, and then I'll turn the camera all the way to you. Okay. Okay. Oh. But I'm sure it's fine. Yeah. Oh. 
Yep. Yes. Okay, everyone. Here we go. But you have to be quiet. This is this is it. Oh my gosh. You have to squish the bag once you get to the sides. But you can do it. Okay. I need to take a few of these off. There are some scissors there. Basically, I cannot fit this. Okay. Oh, I need this back. <clears throat> I cannot fit in here. Oh, I cannot. Oh. I feel like I'm being crushed. <laughs> okay, guys, if you can't be, if you can't be quiet, you can't stay. Okay, loves. Okay. <sighs> It's working. Oh my goodness. Boys, shh. Are you, um, yeah, watching your comments? Take your time and breathe. Check the stitch length. Look at you go. Yay, Susan. So this is Kasaya is her sister. And so every once in a while Susan jumps on and does a takeover. And she sews something. And so all these people I think watch. Okay. She's got like thirty eight thousand subscribers yeah. or something. Yeah, do you see that? Thirty eight thousand five three That's right. Okay, I'm going up over the... Oh, well, you're going up this, Susan. Sarah says, I feel like since Susan has worked so hard learning to sew bags, that I should try to learn to play the horn. Yes! <laughs> horn right there. I'm, I'm telling gonna, you. I'm going to try to play the chocolate. Yeah. Those are all Susans. We should not touch her stuff. I'm going to hand crank. I'm hand cranking over this seam. <laughs> hey, Gabriella, do me a favor. Take everyone out till I'm done with this part, and then I'll put you guys all in the video at the end. Okay. okay? What's your YouTube channel called? I'll show you. We'll tell you when we're done, okay? Go. Grant, Grant, Calvin, Asa, out. I'm going to call you guys all back in and let you be on YouTube, okay? Okay. Can you call us the... Um, and then you can look it up later on your computer, okay? Yeah. Can I go out, please? Yes. Yes, Lollapalooza. Everyone came into the bedroom. She did not move the machine. Grant, I'm not going to move the machine. Grant, out. Oh. How would I move it? I don't know how to sew. <laughs> what happened is, my husband has this showing on the big TV in the other room. And the boys went in there and saw that it, it was YouTube. And they said, wait, is this actually on YouTube? And so they were all excited. They're like, they're doing a YouTube in there. So after we've been in here for what? Two hours. Two and a half hours, yeah. right? Yeah. Um, they just realized what we were doing. And that's why they all came in because they want to be on YouTube. So, well, oh, gee, you're a YouTuber. <laughs> so they're, they're freaking out and it's really funny. So, oh, yeah. She did buy her table to move around. Yes. Because um, her nephew is visiting yes so it's a portable table which yes is nice. so normally i am in the other room but this it's in my bedroom right now so i wouldn't have to move my nephew and his well his girlfriend's the one in that room but there's stuff sitting there. and ella says you can tell that susan is a teacher she tunes the kiddos out <laughs> i mean what are you gonna do we've been in right. here for almost three hours right. we have to like yep we have to be kind if they need us right Yes. They've been really good, actually. They have been. You just got a lot cooler to the kids. <laughs> you are famous. You're right. Superstar. Superstar. Does that mean they will be influencers? They wish. <laughs> they wish they could. They're... 
this is Sherston, Susie's friend. I ha I still um have to walk. I can't think of the word. I have to make sure that they're watching good things on YouTube. I yeah. can't just yeah. let them watch whatever they want. Yeah. So, yep, your street cred went up, Susan. That's so funny. You are groupies. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and I don't know if I have to, but I'm hand cranking over this one again because it worked on the last one. Just because it's that big, thick part, I'm hitting the wall. That's funny. <laughs> hand, crank, hand, crank, hand, crank it. Okay. Bag is beautiful, Glenda says. Thank you. Let's see if it made it all the way through. Well, let me check the. We're at seven percent. Oh shoot! I forgot to get you that cord. <laughs> I got distracted. plugging something in and then let's check to see if the top stitching worked through the big thick seams. I think it did, but I do want to check it first to see if we need to go over any parts. We're just trying to get a computer plugged in. Okay, that should do it. Just goes to any of the side ones. All right. Let's see. We ready? Oof. Just checking, checking. Oh my gosh, you guys, it worked. I can't believe it worked. I can't believe it works. Okay. Let me grab the computer so I can see what you're saying. Um, I, okay, this is it. I, I do have straps and I'll tell you what I'm going to do, but I, I, I want to unpick one side and fix it. So I'll do that after this video. But what I'm going to do for the straps is, um, I'm going to cut this in so it's straight. I'm going to take it through here. And I'm going to put rivets here and here. And I'm going to use this awesome ruler that I have somewhere from Leslie from Jolie Lee that shows where to mark them. I'm going to put rivets here and here on both sides. And then these will be the straps. So if you can imagine that, and I'll do that as soon as we're done. Um, I can't believe it worked. It worked, it went all the way through. Okay, so here we have it. It's the Fundamental Tote. It's adorable. Leslie, you did a great job designing this. That is yeah. so fun. I'm a little sad with the Decaville. I maybe should have turned it differently. I'm not sure what I did. It's a little bit wrinkly, but that's okay. We've got this inside zipper pocket right here with some cute um dotted material we have the zipper only um overlay that i got from julie lee creations it says musically made by susan we have slip pockets that are divided right here and then we will i'll clip on the straps um after we're done and i'll fix that <gasps> okay i think that's it yeah i don't have strap ins heat up with the blow dryer before turning oh for deco the light okay well Oh well, did it. Um, thank you everyone. I am super excited that that worked and that you guys all came. 
and I hope you had fun. And I know it took a really long time. Let's see. Yeah, that's three hours. Well, no, it's okay though, right? Yeah. Um, how hard is it to put the zipper on? Honestly, the zipper part was not difficult at all. Um, it was that was the easiest part, I think. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. Thank you everyone. I will fix the straps real quick when we're done and take a picture of it before I send it home with my friend here. Um, I'm going to give it to Shearson and send, to, send it to Vegas with her. Thank and, you. And now you have a new bag. Do you like it? That's gorgeous. You can use it for church. I love it. Or going out. I love it. Oh yeah, the kids. Thank you. They said don't forget to kid the um, Guys, let me just put the kids on YouTube so they can feel famous, okay? <laughs> because they are hilarious. They don't realize it's just a bag making channel so maybe they think it's like some kind of adventure thing but we won't tell them we won't tell them okay let's get the kids let's let's make them famous <laughs> okay where's Lucas? you want to be on it now yeah hey guys if you want to be on it now's the time okay go stand right here we gotta get them stand right there and we're going to introduce you guys, okay? <laughs> Don't stick out your tongue. <laughs> this is my youngest. Okay, let's introduce them. Come in, come in. We're going to introduce you to them, okay? Okay, how old are you? And can you tell them your name? Do you know your name? I actually don't know it. You don't yes. know your name? He's... Oh, somebody He's... said cool dinosaur shirt. Yeah, oh, cool no. dinosaur shirt. I guess the other ones are just being silly. There's two dinosaur shirts, one there and this one there. This is my youngest, this is Grant. Can you say hi, Grant? Daddy, say hi. You're supposed to introduce yourself. Okay, well, Grant? that might have been it. Hey, I think we all. lost them. Doggy's in the show. Yeah, the doggy's in the show hey, too. Hey, Yes, the no? The dog butt so it's like eye poo. Well. Yep. And that says hi. There goes Grant. the doggy again. Yep, there goes yep. the doggy again. Okay. All right, everyone. Can I introduce myself? Yeah, introduce yourself. Okay. You guys probably already know me. I'm Gabriella, her daughter, and I'm 12. Yep. Oh, you smack you. Me. Oh, don't smack, don't smack yourself. yourself. Okay. Doggy. That's it, everyone. Thanks for joining Wait. us for the oh, fundamental coming. tote. I think they're coming. We're going to give them five more seconds, and they're going to miss their YouTube de debut. I know their debut. Um, thank you, Leslie, for okay, making this. Coming. Sorry, it's got, it's got so loud and crazy at the end, but this is what we're doing. Okay, introduce yourself. This is it. You want to introduce yourself? Yeah. What's your name? Calvin. And how old are you? Nine. Nine? Nine? What grade are you in? Third. Third grade. Do you want to come see? Yeah, there. My oldest okay. is chickening out. All right. And the other one's Asa. My oldest yeah. is a chicken nugget. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys. <laughs>